Hello. 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 Skirt key. Candy key. Hello. Oh. Hi, guys. What? Can you hear us okay? Can Hi, you everyone. Us? Hello. We have the hellos in chat. People can hear. Yup. Hello, every nyan. Nyan? Nyan? We can hear every you. I'm nyan. muted. I just don't believe you guys. I just don't hey. believe you. Shut, shut up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Hello, everyone. Here, Hello. we're gonna go ahead and... Switch on over to the... Main scene, you guys. Here we are. Hi. Welcome back. Welcome back, everyone. We missed We're you. Back. I missed Out you. Out in the game. Yeah. I actually, this is my first stream since being back from break. Ooh! Whoa! Yeah, welcome, welcome back. back. Welcome back. Thanks, guys. Thank you. I wanted to do a little welcome back stream, but it's got to wait for later just because um, <laughs> this takes priority. And this comes first. I actually just got off a plane. Woo, yatta! But Ooh, I'm excited. Fresh. I'm fresh off the plane, so oh, wow. I'm uh, I am excited nonetheless to continue our story. Yes. Oh boy. Me too. Me too. Because mm -hmm. we left off at a pretty yeah. interesting point. <gasps> Maybe we can build a treehouse and we can start living oh. off the land in a treehouse. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just forget about being hunters. That sounds like a great idea. Yeah, screw that. We're gonna be monkeys. Yeah, <laughs> living in trees now. You become one with, become one with the nature. That's uh, I mean, it's possible. If you guys wanted to do that, I wouldn't stop you. <laughs> oh. I would not stop you. The problem is convincing the others uh, to to also go along with the plan. <laughs> cool. What do you say, everybody? Monkeys. Mm. We're about gorillas. Gorillas, welcome. No. Yes. That's fine. Mm. That's fine. <laughs> Maybe we can find a circus monkey and we can bring them along and they'll like do funny tricks. Monkey! Yeah! <gasps> monkey. As fun. long as there's Wi Fi. Uh, there is no Wi Fi <laughs> here. True. No! There's definitely well, no Wi Fi ben, here. No, I'm thank getting you. Out of here. Maybe Wat yeah. Toto can, can rig us um, some kind of LTE service machine or some kind of satellite. Yeah, I mean, you made a cool oh, yeah. sound gun that makes doggies really happy. <laughs> if she can make a sonic sound gun, there's no way that Watoto can't make a, a some way to get television or something. Okay, okay. I like the ideas. <laughs> <laughs> got some good ideas here, you guys. Now, now we gotta put them into practice. Yeah. Gotta, yeah, I'm sure that you guys will find a way. You guys will find a way to, to use those wonderful imaginations because that that is what will mm -hmm. net you the best results, I would say, in this campaign mm -hmm. for sure. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Imagination. Yeah. If you're not sure if you can do it, just ask me. Just ask okay. me. Okay. Okay. Well, today the okay. goal is to finish this mission, am I right? Mm. Yeah. Yep. That would appear Let's to go! be the main goal. Let's go. Ada. Let's go. Yeah, so perhaps we should do a little recap for um for those oh, that need a slight refresher. Oh yeah, that's good. Um, previously on yeah. Miss Breakers. Miss Breakers. That's what we decided to call it. I think <laughs> myth something. Myth Myth Shakers. Myth uh, Myth Bakers. Bakers. The myth myth Shakers. Bakers. Myth Bakers. Myth Bakers. I like that. Myth, myth Shaken Bakers. Bakers. Mm. Bakers. Pretty good. Um, oh, shake and bake. You can put that on everything, dude. Pretty you much. can put. Oh, yes. Sorry, I won't. <laughs> huh? Oh, yeah, yeah. Bake. Sorry, it happens. What? <laughs> shake and bake is it's like it's like pancake stuff. You just add water to it and then you shake it. So hence the shake and then you bake. Oh, I thought oh. you were talking about bacon bits. Oh, a little different. I've always wanted bacon bits. I was never allowed to try bacon bits. Was <gasps> is it just tiny know. bits of bacon? Yeah, yeah. but they like. They don't come cold or anything. They just come like dry, and then you just sprinkle it on. Yeah, stuff. it's like it's like croutons but bacon. Mm. Yeah, and you oh, bake potatoes. Oh, I know those. Oh. Mm -hmm. 
Oh man, it's a must have yeah. for every Caesar salad. <laughs> Yummy. Yeah, I would say so. <laughs> yeah, that's the only it's the only way you can eat that salad. Get the bacon bits and cheese on it. Um. Anyway, sorry. <laughs> back to back to myth bacon bits. Um. Basically, uh, the whole team arrived at the bar and discovered that they were being drafted into a brand new hunter agency. Um. That was. Formerly, a long time ago, um, let's say about 35 or so years ago, um, running very strong, but something happened and they disbanded, and now, and now, uh, the previous owner's daughter has chosen to restart up the agency with you four. Um, Yay! Oh, yeah. We're the Interesting chosen ones. choice. We got yeah. recruited. Yes, you got recruited, that's right, and you got sent on a mission, but unfortunately, due to poor funding, um, they gave you a truck that didn't exactly run as planned. Some things got out of control, and you didn't really make it to the mission. Yeah. Aww. Unfortunately, you guys got stopped on the road when getting some tasty, um... Uh, what, what was, what was the other Landian, other Landian flavored ice cream, and also the special uh, promotional Shrek flavored. Yeah. <laughs> Can't forget the Shrek flavor. <laughs> Um, Ogre flavor. Yeah. Dirt flavor. Dirt flavor. Water flavor. Yeah. Warm yeah. water flavored. Yeah. Unfortunately, yeah. while eating the delicious ice cream that you found on the side of the road, the truck broke down and you had to find your way over to Scotty's Motel, where, unfortunately, you met a world of cockroaches and the truck was stolen. Uh. <laughs> I get to start imagining my future as a cockroach circus, uh, maestro. I go ahead and hire the uh, cockroaches. No, no need for the uh, complimentary them. tickets to your shows. Yeah. <laughs> I you need lots of thread to, to make tiny leashes. <laughs> <laughs> you think leashes work for cockroaches? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Unfortunately, that may have to wait until next time, though, but they'll wait for you. I'll wait for you. Yes, yeah. in my next life, I can wait. Of <laughs> course, the world of cockroach society awaits for you. Um, <laughs> so you guys, uh, unfortunately, had to deal with some grand theft, and away your truck went into a junkyard. Thankfully, um, after stealing a shopping cart from a homeless dude for no reason, um, and walking, pretty much walking, because the shopping cart you just like you got inside it. And, and walked there. It was basically the same pace. Maybe you went a little faster. Uh, you made it to the junkyard. Yes. Get that! Yeah. Hey. And it once may you not got have gone there, much faster, but we look cool as hell doing it. I mean, or maybe I a can't little argue spending. with that. <laughs> In our hearts, <laughs> we're going very fast. Exactly. I can't argue with that. Next time, I may no, have to make you roll morality, though. So I'll be careful. Yeah, that'll be fun. You you watch yourselves. You got a freebie, but next time, oh, next time, might not be so lucky. <laughs> we'll see I could be so lucky, lucky, <laughs> lucky, lucky. Yeah, taking mercy on the oh newbies. Oh my god, see. that's an old song. <laughs> Are you calling me a boomer? Yep, that's okay. an old meme, old <laughs> boomer meme. <laughs> I'm not surprised. Does that also mean that girl is also? Yeah. Uh oh. Yeah. Plot twist. I mean, I almost got she didn't seem to like. She didn't seem to recognize the joke that, uh, that I was making off stream when I was singing. Uh, the internet is full porn. The internet is full porn. Full porn. That didn't even get that. Yeah, right, you're a robot. <laughs> I've never heard what? That I'm robotting. Huh? I'm robotting right now. No, now you're fine. Well, you were but... when you were singing. It. You're oh just telling you to They're not sing that again. The, the world is trying speaking. to censor you. I've been censored. What? Okay, I don't understand. Uh, okay, no porn here then. Yeah, we the gotta what? keep it family friendly. <laughs> you know how we do. We gotta keep it family friendly. That's Look right. Kiara's channel, she can say whatever show. True facts. <laughs> this is Kiara's channel. They're used to it. This is a norm on my channel. Mm -hmm. yeah. 
Everyone's Continue, already please. used to it. No problem, no problem. <laughs> uh, you guys, as soon as you got to the junkyard, things started to go down. And by things, I mean it turned out that the junkyard was some kind of trap in disguise. And there's a hunter, but not necessarily the same kind of hunter as you guys. No, someone is hunting you guys for sport. Mm-hmm. Yeah, set Everybody. up the whole place to, to specifically and target control. you guys. Yeah. AD! AD spam so we can't get a headshot. <laughs> That's how right. do you take down a sniper? We have to think about how to take down a, uh, a sniper guy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, an assassin. Question. Especially As a, considering... Uh, you guys are in yeah, the... Are in the... <laughs> grassy place. Right now. You don't know much about this place. Um, only that it has kind of uh, entrapped you into a, a maze of sorts. Uh, a green, a, albeit beautiful, green uh, and very winding and ever-changing maze that somehow Watato was able to discover by burning unburnable, unburnable Ghost vine walls. <laughs> <laughs> we don't know how Watato did it, uh, but it was he did quite it. something. It was something, all right. And now you have chosen to rest here for the time being, and Uhu is still trying to get to you, Tiara, while being stuck in the thorns from above, but is making oh. some progress, so... Ooh, in ooh. due time. Ooh, ooh. Yeah. That wasn't me. Beautiful that was, that green my forest. It'd be a shame if somebody burnt it to the ground. Mm. Getting some funny <laughs> ideas, Scout. It smells like a campfire. Yeah. Well, if it's too thick, do you think maybe we could send smoke signal? If anybody knows how to send a smoke signal, or is the... It looks a little too thick. The thicket is too thick for the smoke to get out. Right. Well, you could certainly mm. try. Is it, we, we're still I trying mean, to get out, we, but we've just reached, like, this... This... Like... I don't know. Well, what is this place, place right? A checkpoint! A checkpoint. <laughs> a checkpoint. A safe spot mm. for now, if you will, but oh, mm. for now. Yeah. Hey, well, oh, does hey. anybody have any, like, high athletics? Because maybe somebody could climb to the top of this big old tree oh. and see if they could see which way is which. Or, we could, like, look at I... moss on the rocks. Oh. I have been thinking oh. of something, but I don't know if it is, like, applicable here. But I do have mm, direction sense. As a merit, oh. I don't know if that helps. Um, this is a bit of a, an unpredictable area, unfortunately. Um, mm -hmm. You don't really have a good sense of of where you are, and this place seems to be ever changing. So, unfortunately, I don't think that it will help you much here. Mm -hmm. So, I don't have anything athletic, so I suggest someone else. <laughs> I have two athletics, but that's not much. I can start uh, foraging for stuff if need be, but I also have a pickaxe. Maybe I can start hacking and chopping like oh a Minecraft. machete. I don't have any other. Yeah, like Minecraft. <laughs> mm. um. Um. Would you all please roll perception um. for me? The first perception check of the game. The session. Whoa, whoa, Not what the was game. the combo again? Okay. 45 greater than 8. It's wits plus composure. Please roll that for me. And re-roll your tens, please. Oh, you guys are fast. Uh, eight or... Uh, uh, smaller than eight, right? Okay. Uh, greater than eight. <laughs> oh, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, greater than eight. Okay. Oh, nice. Nice, very <laughs> good. Okay, now everyone... Uh, please type how many successes you got. You have to do some math. Uh, two. Two. Okay. It's just two, two. right? Yeah, two. Amelia, one. And two. Gura, two. Is Gura not one? one? Because she got roll greater than seven, but it's greater than eight. Oh! Oh! I thought it was greater <laughs> than seven last time. Oh, no, it's greater than eight. All right. One, one. It's okay. No problem. Okay, and two, I see. So, let's go ahead and start off with both Scout and Watato. What you guys Howdy. see here. So basically what you can observe uh, from this area is that it's very... Uh, 
well, it's rather vast, and it's also very um, well fortified. So, even though it's basically made of grass and, and greenery and thorns and whatnot, um, it's very well protected. So you get the feeling that, that no sniper is going to find you here for long. For long. Um, definitely unable to see anything from the outside. Um, though you can see that there's light filtering in, so that's nice. It's the only way that you're able to see anything at all. Um, and then both, uh, let's see, Yule and Tiara. Uh, you Ooh. observe this as well, um, but oh. you also take note that there is a patch of beautiful flowers. Oh. Beautiful white oh. flowers. They smell very fragrant and seem very lovely and nice. Um, and they're kind of surrounding the tree um, and seem to oh. be... Um, yeah, very beautiful, unlike anything you've ever seen before. Um, and the entire area is full of a nice fragrance. I've seen such a beautiful mm. floor. Oh, yeah? I bet I can make some acid out of those flowers over there. We can burn our way through this forest. Look how I can forest. But it's, yeah. so, it's so pretty. I wouldn't want to ruin it. Nature's you beauty be damned. <laughs> oh, I see we've got some different viewpoints here. Yeah. But they do smell very nice. And also, one last thing that you see is that there are two different directions you can go in. There's oh. an opening to the right, an opening to the left, and of course, the place where you came from. Mm. Oh. oh! Left and right. Mm -hmm. you must should, we a, should we do a vote? Well, whatever Anybody you guys got like a to coin? do. Uh, Pets or tails? Maybe Can we flip a toto? A <laughs> hey! <laughs> flip what toto! If he lands nose up. Land. Yeah. Nose up or nose down? No, please. What <laughs> <laughs> toto is scared of heights. It's okay, we won't throw you up too high. Yeah, just a little bit off the ground. Mm, well, which way do we want to go, Ara? Hmm. What would you like do to you do want here? To go Can we take a look at, like, kind of see what's down each pathway? Uh, sure. We could split up. That always goes Don't well you for know. the mystery <laughs> game. We never split the party. <laughs> never split the group. <laughs> what Toto said. So ah. Mm -hmm. Well, we can, didn't we bring? Didn't we bring some walkie-talkies with us, Ada? I think we can split while carrying the walkie-talkies with us, Ada. That is true. That's a good idea. <gasps> Do the walkie-talkies work? Oh. Would you like Let's to test, test them? them? Yes. Okay. All right. Uh, Ada, Ada? <laughs> Wait, why is there such an echo? <laughs> Do you hear me, Ada? All right. Um, well, you guys are rather close to each other, so of course you can hear each other. <laughs> <laughs> well then, since they seem to work, I think we should split into two groups and, while communicating, walk through the paths, Ada. Okay. That sounds good, good to me. Who Who's wants to go with, with who? who, Ada? Yeah. <laughs> oh, somebody's gonna pick Watoto, huh? Me. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. Let's see what's happening here. It's been nice knowing y'all. <laughs> All right. Uh, um. All right. Which way should we go? <laughs> yes, you must choose uh, right or left. I thought I feels tingly for the left. I agree. Yeah. <laughs> it must be the left All one. All right. Mm. Yes. You and I are going right. <laughs> right it is. Let's go right. <laughs> going right. <laughs> Alrighty then. So it looks like we've got both Scout and Yule to the right, and then Watato and Tiara to the left. <laughs> All right. And what could go wrong? What could go? What could go wrong? All right. <laughs> <laughs> what could go wrong? I'm thinking. Can you Bring imagine? It, can you imagine some curveballs? Yeah. Yeah. Hello? I mean, hello, you're speaking directly to me, if that's what you want. No, 
was just kidding. Please have mercy on us. So... <laughs> Maybe, but you did split the party, so let's see what happens. Um, no. Let's see what Who happens. Who was that? <laughs> I, I believe it was. I believe it was uh, all of you. <laughs> so let's just see what happens. Let's see what happens. Okay. So right. let's go ahead and start off with hmm. Let's see. Right, left, right, left. Um, okay, let's do it this way. Uh, Tiara, roll, roll a 1d2. Ah, uh, uh, 1d2? Uh, <laughs> uh, one uh, one going first or second? Yes. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. Okay, so Two. you guys go second. So we'll start okay, off, right. uh, with Scout and Yule. Alright? Okay. Alright. So. You guys okay. chose to go to the right. So, as you make your way down the path, I'll go ahead and change the uh, scenery for you. As things do, well, they do Ooh. change a tiny bit. Ever, ever so slightly. The scenery is going to uh, change a bit. Here we go. Ooh. Whoa, on your we end. have been in this place before. You've got some rather... <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. You've got some rather tall trees here. Very tall oh. indeed. And if you look closely, uh, there are vines winding in between them. Yes. You can make a didgeridoo out of these trees. You see how nice and long and tall they are? You can make a lot of oh, stuff man. out of these trees. Yeah, it looks could like, we, like the, uh, maybe top in Kyoto. Mm. And take them with us? Just in case. Not a bad idea. Would you How like to gonna... cut down the trees? Yes. Can well, I... at least the pine. Yes. Do you have something to cut down the trees? Um. Uh, no. <laughs> I got me a blade. All right. I'm not gonna use my pickaxe though, cause it's very nice. I'm gonna use my blade. Okay, you oh, wanna use it. your blade? Sounds good. Yes. All right. Commence wood chop. All um, right. Sure. <laughs> Let's give it a try. Go ahead and roll your dexterity and weaponry for me. Oh, oh baby, we're cutting down big trees tonight, baby. Okay. <laughs> we're not going to use the uh, weapons modifier because you're not using this as a weapon. You're using it to, to cut down some trees that it may not be intended to cut down. So just go ahead and do a simple weaponry and dexterity roll for me. Uh, okay. I believe in you. That would be a six. So that's a six D10 greater than eight, right? Okie dokie, yes. Mm. Great, sounds okay, good. Okay, I just don't want to make it. Yeah, you got it. <gasps> <laughs> okay, go wow, ahead and re-roll yeah. that ten. Yes, baby! Okay, uh, okay, roll. One D10. One D10 greater D10. than eight. She's probably making a helicopter out of that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. A chopper. <laughs> but um, Wow, four success. <laughs> okay, with four successes, uh, you manage to very slowly, but surely, chip away at the walls. Um, and the vines, they don't like you doing that. Um, oh, great. Yeah, really great not life. big fans of you uh, chopping down the trees. Um, this is a really interesting part of this area because it's not quite like the other parts in that uh, the thorns are unable to be cut through. I mean, they certainly aren't made of anything that is similar to uh, actual nature or anything. There's something magical about them, but these long trees are a bit different. Uh, these... They're sentient, aren't they? <laughs> They're alive? I mean... I mean... You're not totally sure. You can't really tell. You're no experts on these <laughs> trees, but when you cut into them, it does, it does seem as though the forest is screaming. Oh, Jesus. But Great. you managed uh, to cut yourself a little bit. Are you bit. girls okay over there? Tiara over. I don't. Sam's fine, my boy bleeding. <laughs> <laughs> Hello? <clears throat> Everything okay, Adam? You're cutting off, Anna. Is there... Hello? Mosi, Mosi. Anna? 
You do get a little message from them. <laughs> you can kind of hear, but you are busy cutting at the same time, so. Uh, all right. Uh, wait, what were you saying about the trees, though? They're screaming? The whole forest seems to be screaming as you cut down the tree. Uh -huh. Like, like, uh, really loud, like... Yeah. Or... It's hard to describe. Not much like a human scream, uh. but rather... You can feel it, something reverberating uh, in your bones as you cut down the tree, as though some great force within uh, is crying out. But it's basically too late, because now you've cut a big piece of the tree. Um, it's a decent size. It's about half a human. All right. Yeah, the vines are very <laughs> angry, though. Um, and in fact... As you take the, uh, the piece of the tree that you've cut, uh, the vines seem to be closing in rather quickly. Uh, Could have guessed scout. That. I think we might have to start running. Uh, 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 alright. Alright, this is giving me flashbacks. Yeah. <laughs> once, once again, uh, maybe we should, uh, radio into, uh, uh, let me see if this thing works. Tingly left, come in, Tingly left. This is wood chopping, right? Do you copy over? What do you copy over? Do you oh. copy over? We've got some Tingly. Oh, uh, never mind. We've got some trees, screaming trees here, and the they seem to be closing in on us. How are you guys doing over there? Over. It's oh, a good nice thing that you asked. Us. It's a good thing that you asked, Scout. <laughs> <laughs> because uh -oh. we're gonna go ahead and segue on over. To okay. Wazato and Ciara. <laughs> now, for you guys, the scenery is ever so slightly different. Let's see. Jackpot incoming. Jackpot. So for you guys. Nice. Ah, for you guys, it's it looks amazing. slightly yeah. friendlier. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> yes. So, for you all, for, for you two, you find uh, this place that actually does straight up look like a maze, a rather fancy maze, actually. Um, but the walls are actually very tall. You see, this isn't... Uh, the scale that you may see this right now um, is actually... It's very, very, very big. You guys would probably be about the size of one of those tiles on the ground. <laughs> oh. oh. Yes. Oh. Wow. It's very large. And literally a maze. Mm-hmm. But the one thing that you don't quite see in this picture um, is that those white flowers kind of continue to grow uh, along <gasps> the vines and along the way, and they smell so nice. Pretty. Yeah. Would you like to do anything, like make a perception check or... Yeah. Yes. I, I want to see if, like, when the maze splits up at certain points, which way the flowers go, if they go only in one way. And then we shall follow the flowers, Anna. Okay. Mm -hmm. Sounds good. Maybe, maybe, maybe not follow the flowers. All That's right. A good idea. Yeah. Sure. Go ahead and roll perception. Both of us. Yeah. Uh, sure. If you'd like. Let's okay. do it both. Double the power. Okay. <laughs> you have more dice anyway. Okay. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Sounds good. So, both of you are kind of able to perceive um, that these flowers are the same ones that you found in that nice little safe area, and they make you feel safe. Um, they smell very nice, and you're able to observe that um, they go for a little ways, but interestingly enough, they stop, and they don't branch off into any other, any other direction. They just kind of become a bit less and less. Um, and Watsuto, you specifically are able to sort of perceive that there are not there is actually nothing dangerous about these flowers. In fact, they're very mm. inviting. Mm. Watsuto, take a flower, pick a flower, yeah. Okay. To give to pretty bird lady. <gasps> <gasps> oh, for, for me, Ada. Hmm. <gasps> yes. Wait. Thank you so kindly, Ada. I. Uh, how do you smell I, better? <laughs> uh, flower good for uh, uh, good scent, good smell. Mm. Musk. Oh, it, it does indeed smell very nice. Um, I, I, can I pick a flower too? 
Sure. I'll pick a flower, give it to Watoto. <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> You're welcome. Let, 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 let's continue walking, Ara. We shouldn't ah, okay. waste our time. <laughs> Interestingly enough, even though you've taken these flowers, it doesn't seem that uh, the forest is angry or anything like that. <gasps> so that's the good news. <laughs> you do have some lovely white flowers. Nice. Well, can I use this for potions? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if you'd like to, you have it now, so. Make it into a powder. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Sounds good. Well, you certainly have it now. You have it on your person, so. That's good. <laughs> meanwhile, <laughs> uh, meanwhile, where everyone seems to be dying right now. <laughs> Psych. Psych. Uh, we're here, and um, unfortunately, uh, unfortunately, it seems, uh, let's see, that right about now, you guys, uh, the vines are getting real wild. Uh-oh. Yeah. Uh, shall we <gasps> make like a deer in headlights and run? Yes. Can I maybe, like, search for, like, any exits or anything on the, while, while we're running? Uh, would you, you like can to be my for? guest. Mm. What was that? I didn't hear ya. What would you like to search for? Like possible exits or exits. anything? Sure, go ahead and do a perception check for me. <laughs> oh, thank the lord. Now we roll this Damn, yeah. Nice. <laughs> Okay. Oh. Uh, that is an exceptional success. All right. So, uh, with that a very exceptional success, you'll uh, your eyes dart back and forth as you look around for some possible exit. Uh, the vines are closing in very quickly, and they seem to be uh, definitely interested in uh, taking you and making you a part of them. Uh, oh, however, yeah. however, the good news is, as you kind of begin to back up, you'll you perceive that behind you there's actually um, a perfectly sized hole uh, for people to fit through, huh. oh, that you might be able to escape through, that the vines aren't reaching right now. Oh. Scout, scout this way. There's a way uh -huh. out. Uh huh. Oh. It's it's perfectly suspiciously perfectly sized for us to pass through, but better than nothing. Looks like one of them game show halls when you gotta <laughs> fit through the, uh, the side of the side. Let's go, let's go. What, what let's, let's is hit this it. one? This, this is the... This is the... Uh, the one up close? According to my... <laughs> my uh, well, on the television, Ma used to watch this thing called yoga, 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 and they call this one the tree <laughs> pose. The tree pose? <laughs> All right, you go to the, you go to, okay, the tree pose. Okay. <laughs> you go first, Scout. You go first. Show me how what, what the tree pose looks like. Do I have to roll for this, or can I just go through? Athletics and dexterity. Athletics and dexterity. <laughs> oh, <God>. Yep. <laughs> there it comes. Please get oh, they're ready to push. Stuck. That WD oh, yeah. forty I mentioned in the beginning. I hope you brought some because we're gonna see need it. it. I want to see you pushing uh, Scout's butt uh, through the hole. <laughs> Did you say athletics and dexterity? Yes, ma'am. Okay, ma'am. Uh... Threatening music. Okay. okay. One success is all you need, Scout. You managed to wiggle your way through there. It is not comfortable and it is very tight. However, it is certainly uh, nothing compared to the sharp vines that are going to pierce your skin and uh, and make you a part of them. You're glad to not be a part of them. So it, Thank it feels you, Martin fun. Yoga. <laughs> yes, it's all, all thanks right, to you'll, yoga. We'll get them next right. time. <laughs> Very you'll flexible, time. but... You'll here, fit! Here I go. You'll fit for sure. You'll fit through, okay. So it's, is it minus one if I have nothing in athletics? Uh, oh, you have nothing in athletics. Yes, uh -huh. correct. That would be a minus okay. one. Oh. Oh. <laughs> uh oh. 
So, Scout, you manage to make it out to the other side, and you see that Yule is wriggling through the hole as best she can. However, she gets stuck right in the middle. It's all right. I got this. Do I still have my blade? You do still have your blade. However, I am going to need... First, Yule to take uh, one bashing damage as the vines begin to hit at your feet. <laughs> All right. All right. Scout, Did what I... would you like to do? Um, If I pull her through, it's going to cut up God knows what on her, which is going to cause more damage. Do you think, uh, could I, like, cut the, make the hole wider? Is that the issue? Can I perceive? Can I perception? Sure. Do a perception check and let's, let's find out what's going on. Okay. Before things get too crazy. Help. I'm coming! <laughs> okay. We roll that I ten. rolled it. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. Oh, yeah. With two successes, you are able to perceive that the issue isn't necessarily, uh, that Yule isn't able to fit. Um... In fact, you guys are about, like probably roughly the same size. So that's not so much the problem. It's just that Yule is a little slow. Um, not really the most dexterous. Not really the most muscle-defined, uh, well-toned kind of used to used to Yule crawling in the mud. <laughs> <laughs> C- crawling in the mud uh, like you have done in the past. So she just needs a, a bit of a pull, if possible. Oh, all right. She should be Can okay. I, uh... I did this with a feller back in belt buckle, and I saved him from the man-eating mines. Maybe I can do that for you here, you Could I, like, do the same thing, you think, with the pick- or pickaxe and yoink? Sure, if, you, if you'd like to try. Okay, you we can either use the pickaxe, or I'm willing to use my pants again. We can tie it around you nice and tight and give you a nice tug. I'm, I'm gonna go with the- go with the pickaxe. <laughs> <laughs> you know, if I lose my pickaxe because of this, then I'm gonna leave you behind. Oh. <laughs> but you're not you gonna know, leave me we... behind if you lose your pants? No, ma'am. <laughs> right. I guess. I guess pants. <laughs> Does it matter which one I choose? Like, if I lose, like, a, is there like a, a, a like a material stability thing? Um, it would be a, a different role, I would say. Which one will I have more chance of success with, really? <laughs> well, the pickaxe is real sturdy, but your pants are real sturdy too. I'm using my pants. Okay, <laughs> it'll work. Anything works. Sounds pants good. Pants it is. All right, go ahead and roll wow. for me. Your mm. let's see, let's do athletics and either strength or dexterity, and then do a plus one for strong pants. <laughs> oh yeah. Stitched up by mama. Mama's best. Okay, uh... So strength is three plus one for strong Mm -hmm. pants? Yeah. And then plus, uh, athletics as well. I have no athletics, so that's actually minus minus one. I didn't know that. I didn't know that, because then most of my rolls have been mistakes. Um, It's okay. okay, We know now. So it's a three? Yes. Okay. Do it. Uh, okay, roll three. I'm on mama pants. Yeah. Okay, with yeah. one success, that's all you need. You go ahead and throw uh, Yule a line, that line being your pants. More like a leg. <laughs> like a leg. leg. A pant leg. Yule, you grab onto that bad boy, and by God, Scout, you tug so hard. You tug as hard as you tugged back in the day at the county fair when you had to play the 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 tug the tug of tug of war rope game into the mud. You were not going to be pulled into the mud that day. This is like that. No, ma'am. No, <laughs> ma'am. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. This is just <laughs> like that day. You channel that energy and you bring Yule out of the tightened hole. And uh, thankfully, uh, her ankles are very scraped up, but that's about it. Hmm. And you guys seem to be. All right for now. <laughs> for now. Ooh, and we're going to go ahead one. and uh, we're going to go ahead and switch back. We're going to go ahead and switch back to our other friends who are having a themselves about the time. Yeah. I hear the birds chirping. Beautiful, Ara. Well, you're certainly in a better position than the others. <laughs> you 
you are having a nice walk indeed. Um, however, the maze just continues to wind around and around and around and... It doesn't really seem to be going anywhere specifically. You guys feel like you could walk forever and nothing would change very much. Oh. Uh, <clears throat> can I try climbing up the bushes? <laughs> sure. If you'd like to, go ahead and roll an athletics and dexterity roll for me. Athletics. Uh, ooh. Ooh. I'll give you a boost. <gasps> Thanks. Watsuto, oh, Watsuto boost. Oh yeah, can we add that, please? <laughs> sure. First re-roll your 10 and then Watsuto um actually wait, before you re-roll it, make it a 2. Make it a 2d10 cuz you get plus okay. 1 to your dice pool because Watsuto is helping boost you up. How about that? Oh, oh nice. Wow. Oh. Ooh, so free successes. <laughs> re-roll that 10 yeah. again. Oh, and one more. Oh. Uh, okay, three. All right. Now, let's see. Let's see where this takes you, Ciara. Where does it take me, Ada? Thanks, Watato Ada. I'm gonna go up there and let you know what I see, Ada. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I will, always. <laughs> Sorry, the laughing was Kiara laughing, not Tiara. How does Tiara laugh? <laughs> Please don't ask me to do that! <laughs> Alright. Let me go ahead, I'm trying to... I'm trying to change this you climb up through the vines and... Eventually... Actually Ooh. do make oh, it to boy. the top. Ooh. Of what seems to be a very large hedge maze. Ooh. You've made it to the top here, but it seems that even though you are at the top of the maze, um, what's beyond the maze is just a completely indecipherable mess of green. Mm. However, a friend comes to join you. Yes, I knew it! Finally! <laughs> it's Uhu! Uhu! Finally, where were you, Ada? Uhu flies back to your side, and um, the vibes that you're getting from Uhu is that this place is very confusing, and Uhu uh, uh. was lost. Eh. Uhu. Uhu. Come on. Mm. You know where you came from. You know how we can get out, Uhu. Um. No. Would you like to go ahead and roll an animal can? Uh, yeah. Let's see. What's an animal can roll to get more detailed information from your bird? One and uh, four and wait uh, from burp. If if it's what was it again? If I if I have a specialty in it, I get one more point. Plus one, plus one dice okay. to your pool. So six. Okay, well six, eight, ten. <laughs> oh no! Hello, mossy mossy garlic phone. <laughs> <laughs> It's one of those days when communication with uh with Uhu is not working very well. Uhu just seems confused. That's all that you can get from your bird, unfortunately. Um, um, um at this maybe point we can walk along the top and then Watoto can walk on the bottom. Ooh. We can find the exit. Mm. Yeah, can I try to stand on it and see if walking on it is a possibility? Okay, sure. You stand up, and it seems fine, but it's definitely difficult, and you will be moving slowly. It's a lot like moving through a snowstorm um, or really high sand dunes, where you feel like um, your walking is definitely being um, sort of uh, labored, I suppose. But, can I... Uh, can. I haven't done a perception check up here yet. May I do that to see Sure. If I... If you see anything, uh, it was, uh, well, 3d10. Yes. Okay, okay, okay. Uhu, useless perception, yes. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we got here. Two successes. Excellent. So, let's see, Tiara, you kind of look back and forth around you at the top of the hedge, and it seems that, um, there's nothing particularly strange except for what you've seen before, and also what's interesting. 
it actually particularly strange if you think about it is that the the hedge seems to be changing ever so slightly it almost looks as though the maze is forming new paths all the time and the places where you came yeah. from aren't the same anymore you also notice uh, another thing you notice someone from far away pointing a gun at you <laughs> so you have well, one turn i point my can... gun at him adam <laughs> And I yell to Batato, Batato, come up here, it's... No, oh, no, stay down there. I don't know, actually, oh my god, I don't know. <laughs> Batato, it's dangerous up here. Ada. I say while pointing my gun at the dude. Oh boy. <laughs> oh goodness gracious. <laughs> oh goodness gracious, have, is that... Wait, I have... That sound, uh, I have, like, stuff like quick draw. Is that useful? Um, I mean, you, you have your gun. Thing. You have your quick gun draw. now. Yes. Okay. Yeah, the okay. sniper off. Shoot. Let yeah. me shoot, please. I want to shoot. <laughs> well, see, here's the thing. The sniper was looking at you first, unfortunately. Um, so it looks like we're going to have a... <laughs> we're going to have a little showdown. Uh-oh. So I'm going to do a little <laughs> roll here. Uh-oh. Is that... No one's going to die, right? Depends. What's what? your def actually no defense does not apply. Let's see, defense does not apply here with these here firearms. Here we go. Oh shit. Oh no. <laughs> okay, one second. Wait, is that? Oh, never mind. Never mind. Nani nani. No, it's okay. Never mind. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Um, in this case, Kiara. <laughs> um, let's see. You are taken by surprise. Um, and so with uh, these two successes, um, you get knocked off the. <laughs> you, get, you get knocked off the wall, and you fall to the ground. Um, interestingly enough, though, these bullets, they don't seem lethal. Oh. Ooh. It looks as though you're being hit with, uh, strange bullets that actually aren't piercing your skin, but they hurt a lot. Rubber Ooh. bullets. They hurt you a lot. Um, so I want you to go ahead, and in this case, let's see what the modifier was. Uh, take three bashing damage to your health. It, is, is that the square box under health? Uh, no. Wait. Yes, it is. Excuse me. Okay. That is correct. One, two, three. Okay. okay. Go ahead and okay. put three slashes in there. Okay. I have now four because I had one from last session. All right. Sounds good. So now you are effectively on the ground. Hi, Watoto, Adam. <laughs> can Watoto try to... Wait! Can Watoto try to, 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 to uh, catch me? <laughs> when I fall <laughs> Uh, what? Before I land. Well, I would say it's a little late. Watato, what would you like to do in this situation? You still have a turn. I won't have you guys roll initiative just yet. What? Watato? Watato muted. Oh, sorry. Hello? Uh, Maybe she was time. trying to save me all along. She was just yeah. muted. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh, let's go with that. Did you like to catch her? Um, let's see. You can go. I mean, if you would like to, you can certainly try, Wasato. I'll you try. You can certainly try. Okay. <laughs> go ahead and roll your athletics and either strength um, or dexterity. Okay, well, it's only one, right? Because I don't have one in athletics and I only have oh, two yeah. in dexterity. Oh, but yeah. my strength? Yeah, it's only one. All right. Go ahead and roll a luck <laughs> die. Oh, no. no! No, no, give me the miracle again. The the Watoto miracle. <laughs> Watoto cushion. <laughs> um. Well. Oh man, that's a luck die. Um. Okay. Tiara. Uh, I'm dead. Watoto tries to catch you. Unfortunately, mm. you fall on top of Watoto. Um. And Watoto's oh. nose kind of hurts you. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> 
<laughs> it's a little painful. You're telling me to yeah. hit those, just giving me another bashing damage. No, it's not. It just hurts a lot. <laughs> it just hurts a lot. Ouch, uh, but Wasato, <laughs> Wasato, I will need you to go ahead and take two bashing damage. <laughs> oh, <that's laughs> <good. Something. laughs> to give her trying to be a to hero. Uh, I tried. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Thank you for trying, Watoto. Some some crazy dude is up there, Ada. He shot at me, but it's kind of weird. The, the 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 he didn't use normal um, what's it called again? <laughs> I'm not even role playing. Bullets. What is it called? Oh. Bullets. Bullets, Ada. Bur 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 bullets, Ada. Mm. How are we gonna get out of here? Maybe maybe we have to kill him to escape. I I wanted to, but I. Uh, Oh. I c he was so fast, I, I couldn't even shoot at him, Ada. Watoto has a special powder. <gasps> I traded for this powder. Maybe oh. Bird Lady can use powder to... to... kill. Mm. Powder? What kind yeah. of powder is it, Ada? Uh, power to make you strong. Yeah. Very strong and fast. So, should I take that and climb back up and try it again? <laughs> You. Uh, I see no other option, so let's do it. <laughs> okay, sounds good. But before we do that, before we do that, who is drawing on the screen? <laughs> you can draw uh, on the screen. You can draw on the screen. Yeah. Okay, I, I, I will hold back. Like, I thought I it was not just like feeling like weird notes and stuff. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I have my race it. Oh. I see, I see. Okay, <laughs> all right, you guys. You know what? You have your fun. You have your, you have your fun. <laughs> what like a sleeper teacher. Is. That's what I thought that was. <laughs> We're switching Don't scenes. I'm switching scenes. Oh, you can move. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> we are switching scenes. Now, if you'll recall. Um, both Scout and Yule went through a hole and arrived somewhere most interesting because you see Yule had a very, very, uh, perceptive look at the wall and found a place that actually seems very interesting. <gasps> Hobbits! Hobbits! <laughs> Hobbits! It's Latter! Yes. You have perception. found someone's home. Oh. Oh. Go ahead oh, and roll no. perception. Perception checks. Okay. Uh -huh. Holy cow! Three successes. Oh. Oh. <laughs> they found Bebo. <laughs> Who is Bebo? <laughs> Jewel is Bebo? powerful today. I have Dang. the sights. <laughs> All right. Now, what you both are able to perceive, um, Scout, you see that this is basically what just appears to be a normal home. It just looks like someone's house, really. It's just in a hill um, that is also surrounded by, uh, by a large hedge. But it looks like someone has made their home here. Um, in fact, it looks like there are two, entr two entrances, and they live inside of this hill. Um... Yule, what you're able to perceive is that nobody is home here at this time. All the lights are off in the home. Oh. Hmm. Yes. Interesting. Interestingly enough. We but, um, try yeah. yeah, go ahead. Um, you can also notice that there are some nice flowers around here. But they aren't the white flowers that you saw before. <laughs> they seem to be like fake flowers for whatever reason. Oh. Yes, this place is full of fake flowers. Uh, our GM is smiling when she's speaking. It makes me nervous. Like she's <laughs> planning something. <laughs> so it's the real okay. deal when, when she has that like panic face and she's smiling at the same time. <laughs> That's when you know what's up. <laughs> oh, uh, why would I have fake flowers though? That doesn't I don't understand. Yeah, in, like a forest. Hmm. Should we maybe... Try the door and see if it's open. Jiggle? Yeah, we can jiggle. Jiggle the door. Jiggle, jiggle. Alright. Mm. Uh, that's not gonna take any, um... 
any any turn or anything like that. Mm, uh, you mm. jiggle the handle and it doesn't open. Should we well, try the other one? There's another dungeon, so we could try to jiggle the other one. Are the windows? <laughs> you gonna break the windows? No, just, windows? just check the windows. Check the windows if there's any open, you know? Okay, sure. You look through the windows. Um, everything is very dark in there. Mm. Can't really see very well. They've definitely left this place and uh, turned off all the lights and extinguished all the fires. We can try the chimney. Pull a Santa Claus. Mm. Oh. You sure could. Up to you guys. Um, we have we have vine, right? So we can make a rope out of the vine. We took did we take oh, that's vine or did true. we? You took or a did tree. We take, like a piece of the tree. The tree. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I thought I thought we took a vine, but you, you took a little more than that. Yeah. Um, mm, I mean we could use it like a fire pole, depending on how strong you are. You could like go up and down it as like an uh, escape through the chimney if you we can. are really that. How, how sturdy is the is the wood that we got? Oh, it's rather sturdy. However, you were able to cut through it with a knife. Um, albeit a really good success. So I would say it's decent. Decently durable. Can we is possibly it make like... <laughs> I think it's long dead. <laughs> yeah, there are no more screams anymore. It's just a husk. Can we possibly make some sort of like... Cut it down to smaller pieces to make some sort of like lock picks or anything. Oh, you want to make oh. a lock pick? Uh. Or or like a, like a hinge or something. We can just maybe like pry some. Oh, pry open, open the door. Thing. Make a tool. <gasps> you use it like a like a bashing ram, like the what police used to <gasps> kick down doors. What it's a little, little it? bigger than what I was thinking, but um, maybe something like yet. a cool. <laughs> Crowbar? <laughs> ah, you want to make a crowbar, you know? <laughs> oh, I see, I see. I mean, Scout still has has the knife, right? I'm gonna maybe carve it down a little bit. Something I'm good at similar. making weapons, too. Yeah! True. Well, once you guys decide on what you'd like to make, let me know, and we'll roll for it. Crowbar, Scout? Are, sure we wanna... Are we gonna use up our entire tree on this crowbar? Like, what if this is a trap? Depends oh, on the like size. Flowers. Yeah. I mean, oh. it's just gonna be like thirty centimeters. Mm -hmm. This is a small one. Mm. I mean, I'm maybe a little longer. Mm. How big no, is okay. the tree that we got? Is it just a little shorter than we are? About half a know. human. Half a human. Okay. Half a human. Oh, okay. I and mean, we can probably use like a third of it, maybe. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. Alright, I guess we're making a... What did you say? Crowbar? Yeah, crowbar. Or some kind of wedging? Yeah, something that we can just kind of maybe wedge the door and stuff with. Okay. We're gonna jimmy it. Alright, mm. you guys want to try and forcefully open the door with this tool you're creating? Sounds good. Go ahead mm. and roll for me. Let's see. Let's do wits in the moment. Let's see. Wait. Either wits... Uh -oh. I'll let you choose. I'll let you choose. Wits or dexterity plus crafts. And, let's see, with this wood that you're using, it's fairly durable, so I'll give you a plus one. Huh. Oh, Ooh, this, I got a seven. Good. That's a good roll. Uh, hold on. So crafts plus wits or dexterity, right? Yes. Plus one? Okay. Yes. Cool. Oh. Uh, okay, we roll those tens. Okay. okay. So both of you, you succeed. You manage nice. to create something that can effectively open the door without breaking the door. It's something oh. like a crowbar. Something similar, I guess. And it should be fairly easy to use, uh, thankfully, oh. because of your successes. And, um, however, the wood is mostly used up. You've got some left. But okay. only a bit. Oh. We'll save it uh, for later. Yes. Should we... Can I... Is there a way to, like, further investigate the fake flowers? Like, can you... Is it possible to roll, hmm. like, some kind of... Is there a role to further investigate things? Okay, sure. What would you like to investigate in particular? Are you trying to look for something suspicious, or...? Yeah, just... Like... 
the fake flowers are yeah. they made are they like handmade or are they oh. like did they buy them from like hobby lobby or something okay sure <laughs> so go ahead and let's see um i don't have any points in investigation though right oh, okay. you would have to roll investigation if you wanted to get really detailed information but with a perception oh. check you should be able to answer the questions that you have so let's give that a try okay Wicka 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 wicka. All right. Roll again. Reroll that ten. Okay, one, just one. All right. So with one success, let's see. These flowers actually. Um, are not particularly threatening. There's no threatening aura about them, but it seems strange that they'd be here. It seems more like they were bought from some store um, or someplace, like a Hobby Lobby, but definitely not a Hobby Lobby because you don't think a place like that exists here. Likely, uh. maybe. You don't know, though. You don't, you don't know what this place could be. They could have one. Little hedge Hobby Lobby, mm. you don't know. But basically, you've got some fake flowers on hand that you could basically buy from anywhere, and it seems like they have no real purpose to harm, but rather to be really? decorative. Yeah. Hmm. Just to be decorative. That's very odd. Yes. Very, Why not use real ones? Dirty right? cameras or something hidden in the flowers. No, you think? Little laser beams. <laughs> you think? It, or like maybe like because brightly colored things aren't they supposed to be like uh, deep in your in your brain? Certain colors are supposed to be like, oh, danger, like poison. This is a mm -hmm. poison color, so like they're trying to be defensive somehow? Mm. Maybe there's something underneath them. You would think mm. so, Maybe but they really don't seem covering suspicious. Up. They just, or are like, you just saying that? Place. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> uh, That's uh -huh. what your perception check tells you. <laughs> ah. Okay. Alright, I guess we can go inside then. Mm. Mm. You girls know. never want to use your bathroom and walkie-talkies, do ya? <laughs> oh. Oh. Uh, let us know where you are. <laughs> I think, I think, I think, I don't know. We'd be a little distracted with the new, newly found place. Exploring it. That's okay. true. We'll never find mm. each other ever again. Hello? <laughs> are you guys okay? Watoto out. Good question. <laughs> Wood chopping right, tingly left over. We found some tiny wood boring here with fancy colored <laughs> fake flowers, and I don't know. We, you all and I have made some kind of doohickey. We're gonna go on in and, and see what's going on. Uh, did you guys knock first? Later. Well, we are currently being chased by a crazy dude oh. shooting at us. Uh oh. There they oh. go. Oh. Oh. Oh, if both of us disappeared, then I think. Callie, oh, you're the one who disappeared? You're no. the one who disappeared. You're the well, one. I'll come back. <laughs> it must be me. Uh, don't worry, I'm on my way. Stay there, okay. stay there. <laughs> I see that. I say that. Uh, nice the room that I created now. is gone. Nice tentacles. Uh oh. Nice. What? Oh. Uh -oh. oh. Everything fell apart. No. No problem. I'll just make a new one. Yeah. I'm here. I'm waiting for you. I guess it's just me and good I left. Infiltrated well. the system. Complete. And then there were oh, two. <laughs> I gotta move some things again. Can someone play some elevator music? There's elevator music playing. There's elevator music! I don't know what kind of elevator is you've been in. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's nice music. Yeah, it's a really though. spooky elevator. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't want to get into that elevator. I don't trust it. Oh, Lena's in here. I used to get yeah, into elevators and then the jump. There you are. Why are you like that? 
Um, why? <laughs> I thought it was fun. <laughs> why? Okay. The elevator bounces up and down. A little bit, you know? That's a spooky elevator, my dude. <laughs> By the way, I was doing those crazy ass because I was thinking the white, nice smelling flowers might have just been a way to manipulate us. And even though in the beginning it seemed like Scout and you were going the wrong direction. I feel like kind of we went into the wrong direction after all. <laughs> yeah, these oh. flowers are definitely suspicious. Which I don't mind. I'm more suspicious though. about the white flower. What if they're like, you know, one of those like mind control, like lure, like lure people in. You know, there's they flowers so that like good. yeah, yeah. You know, those there's flowers that smell like really really sweet, and they like lure the prey in, and they like yeah, melt yeah. and eat it. We yeah. are the prey. Well, we just picked some. It's not like we got eaten by them. <clears throat> soon. Watoto, <laughs> soon. <laughs> Alright, we're back, we're back. Sorry about that, you guys. We've returned. We is back. Speaking of which, we actually should head back to uh, the other two. See what they're up yeah. to. Yeah. Alrighty. Watoto. So let's see what's going on with you guys. Let's see, is this the song I want? That's not the song I wanted. Sounds <laughs> nice. <laughs> Sounds like ending is a happy end. <laughs> yeah, but unfortunately, it's not a happy end for you guys. <laughs> not just, not just yet. I won't, I won't say what kind of end it is, but you haven't quite gotten there yet. Let's uh, just side see question: uh, How much bashing damage do I have to take to die? Uh, so it's not necessarily how much bashing; it's how much uh, aggro damage. Um, so oh. basically, you have bashing. It will turn into lethal if you continue to accumulate it, which is an X, oh. not a slash. And then lethal will turn into aggravated damage, which will turn into a full colored in block. What the heck? A full colored in <laughs> block. Um, and then oh. once you get all of those filled in, you're dead. Oh, not a hodo. Okay. Yes. All right. Um, however, it was interesting that uh, those bullets didn't actually hurt you. Because you feel like they should have. Mm. Go ahead well, and roll perception again, real yeah, quick. Tiara. I wanted to do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, before I go up there again. Right, Can we try? I don't really want to go die? up there again. Sure, if you'd like to. Oh, what the oh no! The perception check. I don't see shit. I'm so confused from the fall. I don't. It hurts. Uh. I hit my head, oh no. My cat's on my here. keyboard. Cute. <laughs> 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 okay. Oh, thank god. Okay. I want one more reroll. Oh. Noise. Oh, oops. Yes. Alright, let's see what we got here. Okay. All right, with two successes, with two successes, uh, Watoto, what you notice immediately after kind of getting up after Tiara has completely fallen on top of you and crushed you to the ground, um, the first thing that you notice as you're kind of sitting up is that the bullets that hit Tiara are not rubber bullets. They are real bullets, and they look oh. real menacing. Oh. Yeah. Uh-oh. Like, they look to be the type that should have hurt her very much, but they didn't. Whoa. Kiara, Kiara is protected? Oh? I well, wait. Uh, <gasps> if, if she's looking at them right now, can I pick them up and use them uh, in my own gun? <laughs> um. Well, let's see. <laughs> uh, do you have a sniper rifle? <laughs> no, I have revolver. <laughs> Can uh, you cannot use that. Hmm, <laughs> okay. Um, All right. you know what? You can try if you want. No, I don't want to break it. <laughs> <laughs> really good thinking. Problem is, Kiara knows way less about guns than Tiara does, and... Uh, Tiara is being controlled by Kiara, so... I don't know about guns. Shit. Oh, <laughs> maybe... Oh, uh, Watoto can use a sound gun. Mm. Yes, do it, yes, yes. Ooh, I think that's a good idea, Ada. But 
bird lady, it'll hurt your ears, so maybe we put the flowers in your ears so that uh, <laughs> your brain doesn't scramble. Mm. What about your ears, Ada? Uh, Watoto have, have damage already. <laughs> damage already? <laughs> I see. I'm gonna, I'm gonna bring Ina a little closer. Oh. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, um, I will... Uh, um... <laughs> I will hold my hands on my ears and uh, uh, go a few meters away from you. And uh, also, uh -huh, my burp. I'll I'll hold it okay. and protect it. That should work. <laughs> oh, I want to try talking to whoever's shooting with like a. I don't know if it's possible, but <laughs> okay, <laughs> sure. Amplifying my voice with the sound gun thingy since like a radio. Okay. Sort of. Sure. Communication. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Sounds good. Okay. I have to okay. Roll for that. Let's see. You want to use the sound gun and you want to propel your voice. So I would say go ahead and make this. Let's see. Um, in particular, you, would you like to focus more on getting the message across or like what you're going to say in the message? For example, persuading or intimidating, oh. etc. What would you like to do? What kind of message would you like to say? Uh, per persuading. Wait. Um. Intimidation, yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay, cool. Let's do intimidation uh, plus your presence. Um, and go ahead and add plus two for your gun. Okay. It's a pretty good modifier. Because you made a good gun. Mm. Oh. Okay. One. <laughs> okay, with one success, what do you say, Watoto? Hello? Please stop shooting Watoto and Bird Lady. <laughs> Where are we? We're lost. Please help. <laughs> Do you wanna you wanna maybe throw some throw some uh, threatening in there? <laughs> oh. <laughs> you better stop shooting Watoto and Bird Lady or else I will use my scramble on the sound gun and the Watoto gun will hurt. Be careful. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> That's good. That's real intimidating. Let's see what happens. <laughs> uh. Okay. With one success. <laughs> With one success. There is some silence out in the distance. And then you receive a call back from some kind of intercom. Not quite as powerful oh. as your sound beam, but you do hear so you do hear someone say, "Not on your lives, my dear humans. I'm having too much fun." Oh. oh. You should okay. be dead by now. Why are you still alive? I don't understand. Bird lady, let's kill them. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Excuse me. Can you hear I me? Know what it is. It's the flowers, Ada. The flowers protect us. Oh. Maybe. Okay, maybe we collect a ton of flowers and then we can run yeah. at him. And then, and then uh, I can give you the powder and yeah. you shoot and kill. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> I can try. I, 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 let's do that. Okay, cover me in flowers, baby. What Toto believes in you. <laughs> okay, we can do that. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Sure. So you want to collect flowers? <laughs> Would you like to? A uh, flower power, let's go. How will you hold them? Are you planning to put them in your pockets? I'm putting them under my uh, jacket, under my pants, everywhere underneath. Oh, I see, I see. Gotcha. I'm also braid braiding them into my hair. <laughs> Ah, oh, so nice. cute. Mm, I love that. Cute. I'm getting ready for the party. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, and I want to give her the powder that I had, which I traded um, for originally. <laughs> I forgot what it was. Making a bomb? I don't remember. <laughs> okay. I'll take it, Ada. Thank you. I'll do my best, Ada. What do I roll? <laughs> do all I right. roll anything at all? Are you going to climb the hedge? Yes. <laughs> okay. Go ahead and roll your athletics and dexterity. Uh, Let's climb, baby. Wait a Does second. Does the powder uh, give a two... booster at all? Uh, Wasato, do you remember 
Um, is the powder a healing powder or is it a a weapon powder? Mm. It was like a buff powder. Like I, I remember it being like whoever takes it, like mm -hmm. it makes them really strong or something. Okay, uh, Tr, would you like to snort the powder? <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. Would what? you like to snort the powder? What oh, the powder? Yes, There's no it's, it's other way to. Is there no other way to take it? Can I just drink it? I mean, do like, you have any liquid with you? Do I? <laughs> no. Hmm. Well, interesting. You can just eat it. I mean, you yeah, could I'm eat it like, like a pixie stick, but you don't know. I mean, I mean, I I don't know what'll happen. <laughs> it's up to you. You Find know it. what? <laughs> you know what? I will. I Best will. I will. I can I use my. Do we even have time for this? Can I use my crafts and my survival skill to like mix the flowers uh, with my hands and then make some like you will get probably at least a little bit of juice out of that and then make it like into a smoothie with the powder and then drink it and then I have I have the flowers <laughs> inside me. Oh I'll be God. absolutely overpowered. I mean, you make you make it very creative. I will say. Um, if you want to eat the flowers and mix the powder in with the flowers and make some kind of dish out of it, yeah. sure. Like it will milk. it will take you about two minutes or so, but I'll allow you to do that. Let's go okay. ahead and uh, let's see. If he, if he tries to come at us, maybe um, Uhu and Watoto can distract him while I sure. overpower myself. <laughs> All right, sounds good. Go ahead and roll your crafts and dexterity to create this concoction. <laughs> Though Watson you do hear, concoction. yeah, Watson concoction. <laughs> While you're creating that, though, you do hear uh, the the voice continues to speak to you over the intercom, and eventually Ooh. just says, "Hey, hey, what are you doing? What are you doing? Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> you hear some <laughs> rustling above, and then silence. Oh, did he leave? <laughs> I don't know. You don't know yet. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm making the juice." <laughs> All right, with two successes, you manage to make the juice. Do you eat it? Yeah. Yes. You are strong. I'm strong. <laughs> yes, you do feel as though you've been energized quite a bit. It has buffed you oh. in a sense. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I would say, go ahead and for any role that is athletics oriented, mm -hmm. give yourself mm -hmm. a plus one. And for mm -hmm. any role what? that includes dexterity, give yourself a plus one. Okay. So now I shall climb up the hedges again. <laughs> okay, go ahead and roll your athletics and dexterity. Okay, uh, two, two, uh, six, roll. <laughs> Even then, only two, alright. Watoto, be careful. Uh. I'm gonna climb back up. Ara. Okay, Watoto believes in you. Thank you, Ara. All right. Tiara, you climb all the way back up the hedge. You pull yourself up through the branches one by one. And you feel empowered doing so. You're definitely much stronger now. You make it to the top of the hedge. You look out to where this, uh, this masked fiend was, this sniper. And you see that he is, in fact, running away from you. <laughs> in he a different like direction. It may seem Watoto, so. He's running away, Ada. Should, okay, should I Watoto, follow him? What do you run. think, Ada? Yeah, run. Jump and run, bird lady. Fly. Mm, but if he's running <laughs> away, then we probably shouldn't. <laughs> let me, let me, uh, while he's running away and uh, uh, showing his back to me, let me uh, throw a few shoots at him. Sure, you can certainly start to take aim. Watoto, I want okay. you to do a perception check. Watoto? Yes. Oh, okay. All right, reroll that ten. One success. You hear something in the distance, Watoto. Oh. You hear doggies. <gasps> doggo. Oh shit! Oh shit! It's not the good kind of doggo. <laughs> doggies. Wait, aren't you good with doggies? Yeah. Oh, thank God. Hello, nice doggies. Come, yes, come to Watoto. <laughs> help Watoto, help Watoto. All right, we're gonna stop there for now for you guys. <laughs> and let's make our way back. Make our way back to... To the Hobbit Holes! Oh, no. <laughs> yeah.
<laughs> the Hobbit holes, indeed. Off we go. Let's see. Right back here. Beautiful. Ah, yes. Okay. Oh. Ooh. Yes. Very serene, very calm. This home we return to as you are now breaking in, breaking and entering. Uh. Yeah, not from the inside. Don't let Not crime, from the inside. <laughs> Maybe call out, hello? Anyone, anyone home? You hear nothing. Can we proceed? Roll perception. Oh, yeah. Yes. Look around the house. Can I roll my 10 again? You always re-roll a 10? Yes, yes, always. Well, you guys didn't break into the house yet, did you? I think we cranked the door open, at least. I, I don't remember. Unless we have to roll yeah, for I... that. Yes, you must, you <laughs> must roll for that. Well, okay, we can roll for that. Dang it. Curse my short-term <laughs> memory. I totally thought you guys did, now I'm remembering you did not. <laughs> Darn, okay. we could have, we could have gotten her. You, you could have gotten me. You could have, I, I remembered in the end. It's okay. We'll save this perception roll. That's fine. Uh -huh. Um, so go ahead and do. Let's see. In order to crank open this door, I want you to roll your athletics and strength. And you get a plus one. With this crank. Wait, this is a. Okay, never mind. That was for my perception, but I didn't yes, add anything. We'll save what are we doing? We're go ahead and roll to crank the open door. No. Yeah. Wait, what did that. you say? Strength plus what? Plus athletics plus one for your crank. Okay. Oh wait, wait. It was supposed to be a two D ten. Sorry, I'll I'll uh -oh. roll another one. That's okay. Oh goodness. Come on, Ina. Yeah. <laughs> one My goodness. success. Sometimes one success is all you need, man. Cool. Well, you go oh, ahead and <laughs> you wedge that bad boy in between the door and and the uh, the door frame, and you go ahead and you lean into it. You lean into it, and you hear a little cracking noise as the wood begins to splinter just a bit, ever so slightly, without <gasps> completely damaging the door. And suddenly, a crack, and the door is open, <gasps> and it gently swings inward. Ooh. Now, oh. about mm. those perception checks. Yes. About ah. those perception checks. So, let's see what we got here. Scott, how many successes did you get? Uh, one. All right, it's real dark. Scout, it's real <laughs> dark in here. It's real dusty and musty. Mm, real dusty. dark, dusty, musty. Like the forge when it has when it has been cleaned in a couple weeks. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah, it smells like it hasn't been cleaned in a while. However, very clearly, Yule, you can tell that someone has been living here. How in fact, see, uh, like, mm -hmm. well, it looks like the covers were thrown off just this morning. Oh. Yep, there's still unwashed dishes with semi-fresh food on the table. Mm -hmm. Someone's living here. Well, I don't want to find out who. I just want to get out of here. Yeah. Let's let's maybe uh. <laughs> Wait. The door back up. No. Nope. Can I do a? Can I do a, a? It's survival. I have foraging. Can I use that here to do that in the house? Maybe. Or is that more naturey woodsy? Oh, let's see. What would you like to forage for? Anything useful? Anything useful? Can I do that, or is that too is that too vague? Um, let's see. You're looking for useful items. That's probably mm. fine. Um, all right, go ahead. Anything? You can anything use survival. that could give us a clue as to where we are, what's going on, or how we can get out of the situation. Sure. That's also mm. too vague. Mm. Okay, if you're looking for information, let's go ahead and roll a perception check again. If you're looking for useful items, you can roll a survival check. Which one would you like to do? Oh, I'll do a uh, survival then items. Okay. Stuff. Go ahead and, and can roll I do the uh, survival wits. Sorry. Can yeah. I do the perception to look for? Uh, sure. 
Yeah, teamwork. Information. Yeah. Yeah, let's do it. Teamwork. Okay. No. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. <laughs> It's mine, yeah, baby. Let's go. Okay. Oh my god. We're ransacking this place. They're coming home to nothing. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, got the info. Every fingerprint. Never All miss right. anything. <laughs> never, never miss a single detail. Wow, these are some very good roles you guys got. All right, let me see here. So, first, we'll go ahead and start off. Uh, we'll go ahead and start off with Scout. Yeah. All right. I gotta load my playlist again. Um, so, Scout, you kind of yeah. search around this area, and you see that this, um, this particular home, um, it's not, it's not especially full of very useful items in terms of, like, um, like having an abundance of food or anything like that. But you do find rations. That's nice. Mm -hmm. You find rations, you find... Some rope. It, okay. Very sturdy looking rope. Oh, rope's good. Yup. Yes. And you find some lanterns as well. Oh, oh nice. Mm -hmm. I should write this down. Yes. Yeah, write, write this down, write this down for sure. So we've got, we've got rations. We've got rope. We've got two lanterns with matches. Hmm. Not bad. And a shovel. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Okay, nice. You found some good stuff. Take you found everything. Some good stuff. <laughs> everything. Wait, do I have my pants back on? <laughs> um, that's up to you to decide. Are they I mean, still intact? Or are they like ripped from the knees down or something? Oh, they're still intact. They're very sturdy. Ma did her best sewing them, so. The All right. Mama sewing them changed. The pants are back mm. on, in case anybody was wondering. Why All right. You, uh, ask your ma to make more, make more pants. <laughs> I think I just wanted so to know like, are you wearing pants or not? <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right, we've got Have the you been pants. Has she been walking around without pants until like they got in the house? Well, yes. you didn't say you put him back on, so I think it's likely. <laughs> Alright, I use this time now to put on my pants again. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Sounds good. <clears throat> and as for you, um, Yule. Yes. As for Yule. Uh -huh. You look around this home, and you realize that this place belongs to someone who is not human. Oh. <gasps> There are strange things Could've. here. A strange feeling. Um, oh. Not things that you guys could find useful. For example, I think that Scout pretty much picked up everything that hunters might find useful um, in any way. But there are many strange items here that just oh. look odd. And also books. There are odd books here, as well as a journal. Oh. It looks like it some of the books here are about this place. Ooh. Research about this place. Can, can I can I read it? Sure. Sure thing. So you read That's some. It. You read the book, entitled, "The Hedge." The hedge. Oh, Over the hedge. <laughs> uh, just the. <laughs> uh, just the hedge. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I get I get where where you're going with that though. <laughs> uh, the the hedge. Uh, this yeah. place you're assuming because on the front cover. There's a picture of what looks to be this place. Mm. Many vines entangling around very high walls full of greenery that seem to be ever-changing. This place is called the Hedge. And it is lived in not by humans, but it can trap many a human and changeling alike. It stands as the border between this world and another. Uh. Another place known as Arcadia. Arcadia. Huh? Yes. Arcades. A place, <laughs> a place where fairies live. Oh. Yes. And there goes Kelly again. I'm oh. gone. 
<laughs> My information is too powerful for you all. It's just too powerful. I've whisked you away. I've whisked you away. Here, let me make Arcadia now. <laughs> Maybe you guys got whisked away into Arcadia. No, you didn't. You're still in the hedge. <laughs> you guys are stuck here. And apparently, I'll continue talking. I've made an, I've made a new place. If you guys want to join, yeah. I'll continue talking. Um, essentially. Oh, there you guys go. Thank you. Um, I can probably move. So this place, um, it seems to be a border in between. You're not quite mm. in the land of fairies yet, and you're not really sure that you want to be, to be completely honest, because some of the depictions here seem to be very alien and strange to what you know. Um, in Ooh. fact, it gets to a point where the text is no longer in, um, in the language that you can read. Nope. Oh, oh. It now slowly begins to use lettering that you've never seen before. An indecipherable oh. language, even. Oh. But the information that you could read, um, though it was a bit difficult, you were able oh. to read it. It was written in a human language. But it looks like there's still yet more secrets to be found deep within. Um, and what's also to be noted is the journal that you found. Mm. You see, the journal also had some interesting information as well. Specifically, research on flowers. Oh. And their effect on certain fairy. Because Can you see... Can more into it? <laughs> yeah, sure. Apparently, apparently there are some fairy that don't play very nicely with flowers. Oh. Specifically, some darklings. Oh, <laughs> good flowers. Oh. They seem to be a sort of um, weak spot, if you will. You're not entirely sure how, but it looks like whoever was living here was doing some serious research about that subject. Okay. You're not but sure I how still... it's a weakness, but it is a weakness. Hmm. I still, I still have my phone with me, right? I think. You do. Can I take a picture of everything? Oh, sure. If you want to store this information, yeah. yeah. You have Document. a phone? I do. You have a phone? I thought we didn't wait, have... did you what? wait? Did, did you bring your phone with you? Did you say I you know, brought I your phone with you? I don't see I just have my phone like attached to my hand or something. Nah, I took oh, it away wait. from Kiara, so I can't. I can't. I can't, I can't no! give you that. But well, you can. You can take it with you if you'd like. You can take this info with you. You could okay, write it down I'll, if you wanted. I guess I'll write it down at least. Okay. Mm. Sounds good. You know your head is so small. One second. <laughs> Let me fix that. Excuse me. Well, who doesn't take their phone in GM? Yeah. Ah! Oh, okay. It's okay. Next time we'll I remember, I'll say, do you guys the... take your phones? Do you take I your phones? I don't even go off? to the toilet without my phone. Oh, man. What a shame. I don't even eat without my phone. My phone is my best friend. Oh, man. What a no shame. More phone. I guess yeah, we gotta make I'm a your list. Best friend now. Next time we bring everything. Next we time we're smarter. So <laughs> small. That's okay. It's yeah. fine. No problem. No problem. It's a good. It's something good to learn early on. For sure. For sure. For sure. All right. Now. Next time we'll also bring flashlights. How about that? Yeah. Well, we got idea. flashlights now because I I scavenged oh. some. Remember oh. ah. before we left? Yeah. Yeah. And well, also you... lanterns. The lanterns now. Just... Well, they don't have lanterns, we have lanterns. Yes, you guys yeah. have lanterns. Kind of far away, but... Yeah. Maybe I... Oh, I should have said I, I'll give you guys a, a flashlight. Wait, didn't one of them grab a flashlight before? Because I got two, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I forgot where the sec who was holding the second flashlight. Dang, we gotta write stuff down. I gotta write stuff down. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta make notes from remember. here on out. We gotta- I gotta make notes from here on out! Alright. Uh, consider it noted. Consider it noted. And, uh, let's see. You have two flashlights, so that's good. Um, at least we know that you have them. So once we regroup, we can figure out how to split them up. Okay. Um, now. I guess I'll make, make note of what we found. Yes. I got I have, it. I have also written it down. Okay. Okay. Now. You guys, uh, as you're kind of scavenging and uh, and grabbing these things around you, you hear a noise outside. No. 
No! No! I knew it! They were gonna come back. You hear a noise outside. Someone's coming home. Y'all big. At least that's the sense that you get. And with that being said, we're gonna go ahead and switch back to the other side. Oh. Who are encountering... <gasps> no! Some friendly friends. Ben? Some friendly friends. Well, maybe. Who could say? I don't know. It's kind of kind of up to how you guys take things from here. You two who are still in the hedge. What will happen next? Let's find out. Uh, actually, you guys would be here. As you have now fallen back onto the ground. Mm. Welcome back. Hello, kitty. Yeah, Hello. My, my cat is uh, <laughs> asking for attention. <clears throat> Intriguingly enough, however, we are encountering dogs right now. Doggo! You hear feet. Doggie. Big feet. Feet! Real uh -oh. big feet. These are some big doggies. Like Caribus. Cerberus. Oh, yeah. Cerberus. 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 Yeah. yeah. Three-headed doggy? Yeah. yeah. You're not sure yet, but you hear <laughs> you hear some, some pitter-pattering feet uh, quickly approaching. Mm. What do you choose to do? Wait, am I on the ground too now? Even though... Did nope. I fall down? Nope, you're okay, still, still up, up on the top of the, on the hedge. Okay, okay. Oh. You I wanted to take a shot. Doggy ride. With yeah. my open arms. With open <laughs> Okay, Watsato, you're on the ground with open arms. Sounds good. <laughs> Thank you, Watsato. Uh, you wanted to take a shot, didn't you? Uh, you know what? I'll be looking at the situation, and if they attack Watsato, I'll be taking a <gasps> shot at the dogs. <gasps> oh, okay. Gotcha. These could be looking some mongrels. Okay. Sounds good. Would you both roll perception for me? Yeah. <gasps> yeah. Okay. With your one success, uh, it is enough to realize that what is coming towards you are two very large dogs, question marks? No. Nay, I say oh. not dogs, because when you see them... Oh. These look like otherworldly beasts that vaguely resemble dogs. Yeah, a bit. Oh. <laughs> In fact, they look as though they came straight from this place, the hedge, straight from the walls themselves, covered in vines and dirt and blood and nastiness. These are some grody-looking mongrels. I thought they scrambled to climb the hedge. <laughs> Roll your athletics and dexterity. Uh-oh. <laughs> okay, my Toto's gonna become lunch. Oh, Holy oh, shit. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> All right. All right. Technically, technically, you need a 10, but, oh. but we're, play we're playing my rules, baby. So with the one, with your one nine, you are able to get about halfway up, halfway up the hedge wall. Um, before the doggies kind of begin to start snapping at your heels, Watsato. Uh, I shoot dog! Nice doggy, nice doggy. All right. I shoot dog. Go ahead, <laughs> Tiara, and roll your firearms and dexterity. And do you remember the weapon modifier? It was a plus two, I believe, yes? Don't the, don't the add that to your dice pool. The, Just tell me what it is. Yeah. The, the, the one from... Wait, weapon modifier? You don't yeah. mean the, the push, the boost that I just got from the flowers? You mean something else? Oh, yes, I mean, uh, on your weapon. The gun that you were holding? Uh, wait, did I... Is that re re written down somewhere? It's okay, I remember. It's too lethal damage, so just good to know. Okay. Don't add that to your dice pool. Just roll roll oh. your roll for me. Sorry, uh, 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 firearms and dexterity. Plus one. Okay, With dexterity. your buff. Okay, uh, that is... And, and gunslinger, so five, uh... Five, six, seven, eight, eight. <laughs> okay, let's go. Eight, 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 uh, 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 ten, eight. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Three successes and then with your two lethal damage. Okay, I'm writing this down. Okay, so <clears throat> with your shot, uh, you aim directly between the eyes of one of the beasts <gasps> that is right on Watato's tail. Ah. Sorry, one more thing. Do I get a boost from Gunslinger? This is so complicated, but it says 
At one dot can perform short, short bursts with revolvers at three dots. Can make a medium. Wait, I have... I have a, a gunslinger, I have... Four dots. So it says at... At, uh, at three dots can make a medium burst with revolvers, but doesn't gain an attack bonus. Oh, I, don't I know see, what a medium burst is. One second. Let me put my merit list. Because <laughs> I have all of these here. <laughs> I've been looking at it the whole time to trying to get it into my brain. Did you have a specialty, by the way? Yeah, yeah, gunslinger. Okay, let's see. And I also have subduing strikes. I don't know if that does anything, but it says you can pull all, you can pull blows with a weapon to deal bashing damage without spending willpower. But we haven't been using willpower. I don't know. Gotcha. I see. I see. One second. Boom. You said that it's a specialty, right? That you had it marked yeah. as a specialty? Yeah. Okay, if it's a specialty, it's just a plus one. To your roll. Oh, okay. Yeah. Let's see. Oh. But you also have it as a merit, do you not? Ah, uh, uh... Not that. I have subduing strikes. Loaded for bear devils, also something. Loaded for bear. Gain extra reloads. But we have uh, unlimited anyway, right? Yes, yeah, so so. we were gonna change that to something else. <laughs> uh, and uh, yeah, I think for right now, mm -hmm. uh, on fire, I'm special. Uh, whenever your defense is available, you can draw a weapon that falls under a chosen weaponry or firearm specialty as a refle uh, reflexive action. Yeah, that, I don't think that reflexive does action means that you don't need to take a turn to do it, so you oh. do it kind of immediately. Oh. Yeah, because all of these oh. actions take turns. Oh, so can I not take a turn for shooting the dogs? Ah, uh, let's see. Or is the difference though? It's a reflexive. I... Let's see. What was the reflexive action you said to shoot? It was a reflexive action. Uh, yeah. When whenever I, no to draw a weapon, it is. It's, okay. It is yeah, just to draw it in the first place. But we haven't been that exact about it anyway. I think. Yeah, I think that you already. <laughs> You already drew it, so you have the weapon yeah. drawn. Okay, okay. Yeah. Let's just shoot. Yes. Uh, so yeah. That that is eight. Did you add the plus oh, yeah, one? The same for your gunslinger uh, special. I did. I I did. Let me check one more time. Uh, dexterity two plus one is three. Firearms of uh, five. I did. I did. Okay, good. I think that we'll change the name of that later to something like gun specialist or something like that, or like revolver specialist mm. or something. Um, okay. All right. Sounds good. So with your three successes, you aim right in between the eyes of the dog. The first one. Um, and okay. you... Shoot. Shoot! And bang. Boom bang. goes the dynamite. You actually land a really clean shot that actually manages to knock the beast back against the wall, hits them against the thorn, and they seem to be very wounded at this point. <gasps> You've still got one more doggy that's kind of uh, snapping away at the heels of Watsuto at this point, but Watsuto, you can make another uh, another roll oh. to try and get to the top of the hedge. Oh, can I, could I instead uh, use it to <laughs> use my sound gun? Maybe mm -hmm. I'll put it on a happy, happy dog mode. <laughs> oh yeah? Sure, <laughs> sounds good. But interestingly enough, the reason that uh, you were putting that you uh, initially had it um, on happy dog boat <laughs> was because you failed the roll. Oh. So what you could do in this case is still roll, and if you fail, it ends up being a good thing for you. Oh, okay. Do let's I give it a try. should I roll? Uh, let's see. Go ahead, and in this situation, I'll have you roll. Um, let's see. It's, it's a sound gun, so we'll do firearms, plus dexterity, and let's do plus one. Okay. For the mods that you put on it. <laughs> yeah! All right. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, be. So, uh, you fully draw the sound gun and blast it off with the intention to do harm, and it does the opposite of what you want, um, uh. which is to make the doggies happy. Yeah. <laughs> and at this point, the dog on your heels kind of like backs off mm. and doesn't seem to bother you too much. The other one that's pretty wounded kind of doesn't like you guys already. Um, yeah. So there's kind of no changing that situation. Um, mm. 
but you did manage to do it to one. One of them seems to just not really bother with you anymore. Just kind of backs off and starts like sniffing around. Oh. Yeah. Hulk. Now, Watsuto, <laughs> you're hanging on the edge of the on, on the edge of the hedge, and Tiara, mm. you're standing at the top of the hedge with your revolver in hand. I shoot again at the second dog to give <laughs> Watsuto more time. <laughs> <laughs> no. All right, roll again. Oh, wait, don't <laughs> Ah, you can do it. Just, just hang in there. <laughs> but maybe we can ride the dog. Ride the dog? Eh? You wanna ride the dog? Gonna need some good oh, animal dear. Ken for that. Just a little tip. <laughs> well, I mean, I also have animal Ken, but <laughs> I don't. I, Tiana does not want to do that. I think. Ah, uh, I. Well, I'll, I'll just to be safe. I, I will. I will. I will, I will, I will do the thing that I said in the first time. No. <laughs> All right. No. If this is uh. your wish, go ahead and make the same roll. Oh, ah, oh, wait oh. one more. Uh, one d ten. No. Okay. Because one. it is starting one. to stand up again. All right, one success. Uh -oh. no. Okay, let's see. Ah, I, I mean the one that was dancing around happily. Oh shit. Ah. <laughs> I see. I well, well, you're you've definitely, interesting. you've definitely <laughs> aggravated, uh, you've aggravated this dog again. But you have also done damage, um, and it has been hit, and it's it's blown back and hit against the thorns, um, and it's no longer a happy dog. Um, now they're both beginning to stand up again. Wasa, so you have another chance to climb the hedge. Uh, uh, uh. Hey, they attacked Watoto. I need to protect Watoto. They're dangerous. Oh, poor doggy. Um. Uh, what that's all. We'll drop down to go near the doggy. Oh boy. Matoto, what are you doing, Ada? Uh, all right. You drop down to go near the dogs. Um. They are not happy. Nice doggy. They're not happy, Watato. Um. Nice but doggy. you approach. They're both very angry. What do you choose to do in this situation? Do you want to use your animal can? Uh, Watoto has one mushroom left. Maybe the doggies will like the one mushroom. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you have one mushroom. Okay, sounds good. What do you do with this mushroom? Do you put it on the ground? Uh, do you feed it to it the dog? Half, okay. And then throw one to each dog. Okay, sounds good. You throw the mushrooms to each dog, it bonks them on the head. They don't really seem very happy about that, but they sniff the mushrooms. Mm. Alright. Good mushroom. Mm. Watsuto, yeah, I me. need you to roll... I need you to roll a 1d2 for me. Yeah, me. Uh, uh oh. Okay. <laughs> Ah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> no. All right. Um. So the dogs eat the mushroom. They they in fact they give it a little lick. They just give it a sniff and a lick. And after that, the dogs stand up, <laughs> look at you, look at Tiara. And they begin to walk away, and then walk into the, walk into the hedge, into the bushes. They, they bump into the bushes, and then they kind of back up. They begin to walk away, and then bump into more bushes, and then back up and and walk walk away into more bushes, and then they fall down and stand <laughs> up again, and then walk into some more bushes, uh, and then they fall down, and then they stand up and sniff the bushes, and then they fall down again. And then they stand up, and then they walk into the bushes again, and then they turn around the corner, and you hear them continue walking into the bushes, and falling down, and walking into more bushes. What? Are they okay? I think you drugged the dogs. Uh, what? Well, the mushroom. Quite powerful. At least, uh, mm. at least there are no more danger, Ada. Good job, Watoto. Mm -hmm. They're very wounded, though. Boys. Leaving a trail of blood behind them. Maybe not so good job, but they... <laughs> <laughs> oh, you oh, know you had uh, to do. Maybe we follow the doggies. Mm. Maybe they know an exit. 
Okay, I jumped down oh. from the hedges to join Watoto. To follow uh, the blood. Mm -hmm. All right, sounds good. And do you follow the trail of blood from the doggies? Yeah, sure. Sounds good. So as you guys do that, we're gonna go ahead and switch back to our other crew. Yeah. <laughs> that is just now hearing oh, someone no. has arrived home. <gasps> okay. Uh. Can do we hide? Do we? I was gonna say, do you want to like do a perception roll and see if we can hide in anything? <sighs> sure. Start off yes. with a perception check. <gasps> okay. Come on, you old big perception roll. Yes! <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Why? Why? That's what I was I'm talking about. <laughs> Alright, re-roll them, re them tens. Seven! <laughs> Alright, I'll take it. Oh, wait, one more. Oh my gosh. Thank you. Is Xena still doing two more re-rolls? I think? No, I think... Nah, she's done. Two, it? Yeah. She did three. She re-rolled the three mm. tens. Ah! Oh, All right. I see, I see. I thought that was a single one. Okay. So we've got Scout with uh, one success and then Ina with six Ooh. successes. So, <laughs> Scout, what you would immediately assume from the experiences that you've seen, at least in the small amount of media that you've seen in your life, is go hide right. in the cupboard. <laughs> you know? Essentially, yes. Yeah, go hide in the wardrobe, uh, go hide under the bed, etc. Either that or pull like a like a kung fu move or a Spider-Man move when you stick to the ceiling, right? Like, you know, above yeah. the door, like you push yourself uh, into the corner of the wall for as long as you can and hope that they don't turn around and look up. Right, exactly. Actually, people like... Yeah. Or like if you stand behind the door when it opens, like people don't expect that and then you can like... Yeah. Slip hide out, the door. right? Yeah. Catch it on yeah. when they're closing in and slip out, hmm. but... That's that's the smart but, thing. But what do I do I do, GM? Well, that would be up to you. These are the options that you've been presented with you uh, to to huh. you. You have uh, a wardrobe under the bed or maybe in a cupboard. Um but you'll you actually notice that there is um a secret area behind the hmm. bookshelf that was full of books. <gasps> hmm. It looks like there's a small room behind there. Uh -huh. Can try try sneaking into there? Sure, you don't need to sneak. You have one turn before right, shimmy, shimmy. before anything okay, okay. starts to happen. So, okay, make my way to the small gap. Is there is there enough room for two people or just one? It looks like there is. Oh, Kelly looks so evil right now. <laughs> so uh, evil. Uh, <laughs> Wait, she she isn't using the crazy face yet. We're we're okay so far. It, okay, it's okay. it's it's astonishing though. No, with the, with oh, the there normal face. There it is. <laughs> oh dear. There it is. Okay. Is is it like 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 closed behind the door? So I have to open it up. You have to push the bookshelf. Okay. I'll try oh, to push the bookshelf over a little. Yeah. <laughs> That's okay, I'll give it to you, because you succeeded oh. so tremendously. <laughs> you pushed the bookshelf. Scout, scout, maybe we uh, can hide in here. Okay. Yeah, Alright, I'll go with you then. Okay, okay. And then cl close it back up. Okay. You're now effectively hiding behind the bookshelf, and as soon as you finish putting that bookshelf back into place, the door slams open. Dear God! And someone enters. <laughs> what kind of footsteps? First, you hear pretty rapid footsteps, as though they're looking for something or someone that they know has entered their home. Or they have more than two feet. Like no, just two feet. One person. Okay, just two feet. Okay. All right. Well, humanoid, at least. Oh. Attacking us? Uh. Uh. What do we do? Do we hide so, again? Do you maybe get away from the book and maybe see what the hallway or room is yeah, like? Yeah, the room. Yeah. Perce Another perception? perception? Sure, Can perceive. We? If if you want perceive? to, but if you move around too much, you'll need to roll a stealth roll. 
No, so we'll, say, we'll, just, we'll just stay in the same, same spot, but just like look around and see. All right, go ahead. Yeah. We have lanterns. Maybe we can... Look. Oh, that's a bad idea. Never mind. Uh, never mind. I mean, it depends on if the bookshelf is like light see-through. <laughs> oh, well, let's just check. Okay. Ah, we... <laughs> we <laughs> what the heck? Okay. Okay. Look around the room. You look around the room and it's pretty much empty Whoa. for the most part. It seems as though this place was made for hiding. Oh, oh excellent. In some sense. These are some good rules. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, but the interesting thing that you find um, are actually a bunch of fake flowers in here. Oh. Mm -hmm. huh. Yep, there are a decent amount of fake flowers. Various ones, actually varying kinds, varying brands around here. As Scout, you also kind of noticed the same thing. It's those dang mm. fake flowers. Mm. Yeah, but there's some different ones than the ones that you saw outside. It looks like this person has been arranging a variety of different flowers, but it seems like they're really just for decorative purposes. Mm. Not according to, to that me. book that you all found. Should we maybe take some? Maybe if if there's like a darkling or something, we can use it against it. Pretend mm. that it's the real thing. Right. Like how, how fake do these look? Do they look real at like like first glance? But then when you look closely, they're fake? Or is it like obvious that it's fake from first glance? Let's see. Up close, if someone was standing right in front of you, they'd be able to tell. But from far away, might be fine. Okay. Maybe however, we'll take a, a couple however, of each. There are various colors, though, is the thing. Oh. Can uh, take one of each. <laughs> sure. Multiple. Yeah. All right. Make like a little small bouquet. <laughs> little small bouquet. All right, I need you to roll your stealth if you're going to be picking flowers around these parts. Right. Stealth was... All right. Can roll I craft your... a lay? Sure. For easy carrying? <laughs> sure, if you'd like. But I'll need you Not guys to I... roll your stealth and dexterity. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> uh, I will. For stealth. Ah. Uh. <laughs> uh, that's gonna be yeah, a minus it. one. Yeah, I don't have a... No, okay. So just dexterity okay. minus one? Yes, ma'am. Oh, maybe I should maybe I should leave it to Ina. Got um, it. I got it. <laughs> All yeah. right. You're able to gather some flowers, Yule. I would say several. Uh -huh. Maybe about six or so. Okay. Yes, you gather about six flowers. You've got two white ones, two red ones, and two uh two orange ones. Okay. The did Yule's perception only reveal the flowers? Like not the like what what shape is the room? Where are there windows or any doors or anything? Yeah, there's nothing inside. It's basically just a small mm. room with like the tiniest light ever, and many fake Fair. flowers in the ceiling. Is it like a in the ceiling, like a hole, or is it? Yeah, there's a tiny a little glass bulb that seems to have some kind of like flying uh, light insect inside. Ah, mm. yeah, All it's right. very fairy-like. Mm, maybe it's for the better that it stays in this little bubble. <laughs> Alright oh, then. <laughs> uh, what do we do? I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do, but to hide. You hear some hey. rustling noises outside. Right outside the bookshelf? Or? That's right, as though they're realizing someone has been through their stuff. What do they know about the secret passageway? Well, it is their they home, must. isn't it? It's their house! <laughs> Whoa! Uh -oh. Well, there's... Um, wait a minute. You said there was two exits, right? We went in one way. How do we get to the other exit? Is there like a... Maybe there's a... Uh, is there a, There's gotta be like another bookshelf or something in here to get to the other side of the house. Right? In this particular room? The Maybe. secret room? In the house there was, but um, not in this little hidey hole. This place was specifically uh, made to hide and only has one exit. Yeah, okay. Now, we're gonna go ahead and switch back to the others. 
as you are left there kind of looking very, uh, very intently for some kind of solution uh, here. I wonder uh, what you'll do. Uh, all right, I think maybe can we help the drugged up doggies uh, with both of our <laughs> animal cans to maybe get back to their senses? Uh, sure. You... I mean, is that what you want? I don't know. That's. I've... I. What the... Is that what you want? I don't know. <laughs> oh. Uh. I thought maybe we could just follow the trail. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> okay. Because they're so drugged up, I don't know if they're gonna lead us anywhere at all, but. Okay. Let's, let's just follow them then. Yeah. So you guys follow the dogs. I mean, they do seem to be going somewhere. It's just taking them a while. Oh, it's wrong. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're, they're bumping into a lot of thorns uh, along the way, but they are leaving a little trail for you guys. Mm. And over time, it seems as though um, where they're taking you... Um, the maze is kind of shifting and whatnot, but eventually oh. you get to a point where it stops shifting. Oh. And the uh, the hedge begins to just kind of sit still, almost as though um, a way is being created to a specific place. Hmm. Look, look. Oh. And before you know it, the doggies have taken you to this area. Oh, Get that, oh, finally! Nice. <laughs> Do you think okay. maybe we should, now that we're in a new place, maybe we should check in on them and uh, we could radio them? <laughs> you wanna use the walkie talkies? Yeah. Oh dear God! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> we, we, no! We don't know! <laughs> we, don't know. <laughs> we don't know that they're currently we hiding, know. so we don't know. Uh, I, I think our natural choice would be to, yeah, try to contact them. <laughs> <laughs> Um, oh, I didn't get a the... response. Huh. What, eh? Have you? Huh? Let's try. Let's okay. Try. All right. Uh, uh, Watato and Tiara oh, here. We know. made it. We made it out of the oh. jungle. Uh, you guys okay? Where are you? Over. There we go. Sure, yeah. And what are you doing? You're gonna get us killed. <laughs> Oh boy. Wait, what's going on there? What, what's what's happening? Is there, Over. Is there can I rip the batteries the out? <laughs> <laughs> um, you can. You can do that. However, the damage has already been done. Oh, oh no. You immediately hear... I made a new place, by the way, you guys. Okay. Um, okay. <laughs> you immediately hear... Um... Someone has realized you are here. Yeah. <laughs> You hear someone kind of gasp behind the bookshelf. Well, I never. You've been here the whole time. And he pushes Sorry, the bookshelf. I think, I think it didn't work. Why? Maybe one more time. Make another one. E if it doesn't, um, what should we do? Maybe someone else. Cardboard. Cardboard. Okay, it definitely did that time. I, I found Some it. Mic. Okay. Okay. Well, I hope you guys are preparing a response, a written essay for this being. Uh, <laughs> for intruding on uh, on his house. Is it the sniper guy? Because he doesn't like the flowers, right? You're not sure yet. Uh, oh, you guys haven't uh, seen him. Oh. Uh, Alright, one sec. Um, Big, and then Ina. Yeah, prepare your written essay. And you guys outside, um... Outside the home, uh, hear very clearly that the batteries have been ripped out, or that something is suddenly cut off. Uh -oh. <laughs> yes. uh, but not enough to know uh, that they are inside that home. <laughs> Fortunately, that's weird. Uh, the door would be kicked wide open, right? And they would see that pretty much right away. Oh, sure, uh, of course. But if it's you guys or not, might not be sure about that. Mm. And they might hear the voice of the person being like, "What, is that? what are you doing in here?" Mm -hmm. Oh, maybe. Roll perception. Mm -hmm. Okay. Have they okay. roll? Ah, okay. Let's... I guess... Well, it, should we go first or they? Should, uh, <laughs> are we going? Let's see. You guys can go ahead and roll. 
<laughs> oh. Exercise stuff. Oh shit, we don't hear shit! <laughs> oh no, um... Uh, it's no. with you guys. <laughs> oh no... Okay, let's see. Right, indeed, um... <laughs> you guys don't hear anything inside the home. As far as you're concerned, no one's there. Hmm. No one's there oh. at all. Uh, maybe, but lady, we can uh, ransack the house and find some useful things to take. Hmm, that's a that's a good idea. But wait, do we see that the door is open? Yes. Okay. Well, I think since Watoto, since the door is wide open, we should maybe be careful about entering the house, Ara. See if someone's okay. there first. Maybe sneak through the window or, or something, Ara. Okay. But Toto okay. is good at being sneaky. Also, I uh, my danger sense is telling me something is off. Oh. All right. Let's let's take a look through the windows. Okay. You look through um... the windows and roll perception. Again. Wait, okay. did you guys just roll? Yeah, but yeah. we just didn't hear any shouting. Oh, I see, that's right. You're looking through the windows. Sorry. My short-term memory is uh, breaking up on me today. Alright. Go ahead and look through the windows and roll one more time. We are looking nice. this time. <laughs> Alright. Um, let's see. Tiara, you see someone pushing a bookshelf. Um... Oh. Watoto, you see the sniper pushing a bookshelf. Oh. <laughs> and, Scout, Yule, the bookshelf slowly is pushed to the side, uh -huh. and you see a hooded uh -huh. figure in a green robe, shrouded in darkness, looking at you two, with a sniper rifle in hand. A mystical <laughs> one. Well, it's, it's not a close-range weapon unless he's got really good, like, COD gamer skills, so he's pretty much useless. <laughs> There's 16 those Could hit you with it. Yeah, that's true. Good, but I've got a pickaxe. That's <laughs> a close-range like, weapon. Take him by surprise, like, as soon as he opens... Just, like, jump we get, out. We get on either side of the doorway, and then he comes in, right? With his big stupid face, and then we just dogpile on him on the sides, and then I'll choke him out with my pickaxe, and then we can all head for the door. Uh, That's can I great. Shoot him while he's still like opening the uh, like at the moment where I see, uh, where he's pushing the shelf and I see the two girls stuck in there, and he's still with the back towards us. Mm -hmm. Can I quick draw and shoot him in his back? You don't see the other two yet, but if you would like oh. to shoot, you may through the glass. Is that what you want to do? The... Oh, but no, I want to move over to the door and uh, to the open spot. Okay. Mm -hmm. Sounds good. You move over to the door and you draw your weapon. I draw my weapon. Okay. How powerful are those bullets though? Like, is he gonna go through the guy and then hit one of us? Nah. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> All right. At this point, after pushing the bookshelf to the, to, after pushing the bookshelf to the side, um, this being kind of points at you guys and says, "What are you doing here? Uh, what do you uh... want with me?" We were lost, and we didn't mean any harm. <gasps> Sir, we're scrapbooking. We needed these flowers for our vacation scrapbook. I know who you are. Uh, and he pulls out his weapon and gets ready to shoot you guys. Sir, that's a, that's a, that's a, I know you're not getting ready to shoot us with a sniper rifle. <laughs> 360 no scope? This guy. All right, Tiara, you can take your shot if you want now. <laughs> Tiara, you had one job. <laughs> Eight dices. Eight dices and I miss. Oh my Eight God. Eight dices. First time. Oh my god. <laughs> um. You take a shot. Um, I wanted to help. <laughs> see, already take a shot. And, um. Pew! The bullet yeah. scrapes past Yule's face. <laughs> 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 Leaves a tiny scar. 
<laughs> well, but that must have startled the dude at least, so... He does turn around very quickly and points the weapon at you. <gasps> oh my god, this is such... But he sees my face and he knows I don't give a shit about his bullets. Not much, at least. <laughs> well, yes, there is a moment of realization where the homie looks at you and realizes that you have white flowers on you. I have them all over my body, yeah. <laughs> and takes a step I also... back. Oh. I, have... I have a shovel. I could bonk him over the head right now. Yeah, yeah. We That's have him true. from both sides right now. We have him from both sides. He's incredibly outnumbered. Mm, yes. True. Bonk him. Either that or I could give you all the shovel for bonk. And I mean, I've got other weapons as well. I've got a rope. We can tie this fool up and then... Ooh. Question him, interrogate him. Yes. You also got a taser. A taser too. Well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> can I can attack him from behind with a taser? What does my... If you'd like to wait. do that, sure. This wouldn't be a do morality it. because we're in a life or death situation potentially, so... It is yeah. self-defense. Mm. Yeah. But can we do that? Watch from window. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> I mean, we can ask questions later. I'm yeah, sure, I'm okay. sure they'll survive. All right, what do we roll? All right, you're gonna use the taser? Yes. I've passed. Oh, the taser? Do I use the shovel or do you use the shovel? You can use the shovel. I have my taser. All, All right. right. Ooh, ah. <laughs> All righty. So, let's see. For a shovel, go ahead and roll your... <laughs> Weaponry plus dex... Not dexterity, sorry. Weaponry plus strength. And I'm gonna give it a minus one because this is a shovel and not necessarily a weapon. Bam, anything is a weapon if you believe in it. True facts, <laughs> I guess. But still, go ahead and take a minus one. And then for taser... Minus one! Minus one. Oh. Unless you have um, a specialty in using shovels as a weapon or improvised weaponry. I have aggressive light weapon. Would it count as aggressive? <laughs> <laughs> Shovel's pretty heavy. Let's go ahead and make it a weaponry plus okay. strength minus one. And then Yule, for your taser, we're going to have you roll weaponry plus... Let's see. You know what? You don't really... You don't need to be strong to use a taser, do you? Oh, you just press a button. Yeah. Aim? All right, I'm going to make a special exception in this situation. I'm going to let you use dexterity and weaponry. Okay. I go ahead and make those rules. Okay. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Oh. <laughs> I feel like we're gonna kill him. <laughs> nice <laughs> trip, man. Oh, please. That's how we do it back in belt buckle. All my practice is scooping all the horse poop. <laughs> kill him. <laughs> okay. Kill him. I have one success. Oh, I didn't well, you, gotta, you. you gotta reroll two. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh, my God. He's gonna die. Bella? Okay. okay. <laughs> okay. Kami Samas put the put the kibosh on that right there. Alright. Um, let's see. So you go ahead and wind up with that shovel, scout, and you swing it forward. Yeah. And you bonk him on the head. And um this sends the homie flying forward, actually. <laughs> face planting into the ground. And then as soon as he face plants into the ground, about Comedically enough, about one full <laughs> second later, the taser just kind of flops on top of him and shocks him. <laughs> <laughs> you don't move too much, though, because the shovel has already knocked him out, but now he's definitely mm -hmm. out. Like a light bulb. No light. All right. <laughs> like a light bulb. I'm up. What to do? Search around. pockets. <laughs> Pickpocket up. Come on. All right. <laughs> I feel like if we were to just leave him, he, I mean, if, I mean, wow, we, we don't know that actually. Never mind. Maybe I can't see. I don't know. We have a rope. Maybe we can tie him up and question him. Get more information. And question him. Yeah. Okay. All right. Or we could just leave him. Ah, 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 ah. Uh, can I uh, steal his sniper rifle, please? Thank you. <gasps> oh, nice. I mean, you can take it. <laughs> <laughs> Mine now. I'm taking I, it. I want to search his pockets. All my right. character art has a sniper rifle anyway. I was I was missing that in my inventory. <laughs> wow. 
All right. Well, that's it. So if you want to search the pockets, go ahead and roll. Let's see. Well, you don't really need subterfuge. The dude is out. So I would say, let's see, to look through pockets, um, mm. I'd, I'd just say I'd give you a simple, um, let's see. I have a pickpocket skill on lar larceny. All right. Go ahead and use your larceny pickpocket and also dexterity. And he's out, so I'm going to give you a plus two. Oh. <laughs> it really should just it's be like an easy seven. find. Yeah. A less? Uh, oh. Oh, oh. I got something right. <laughs> okay. With two successes. So you search um, through this poor soul's pockets. Um, and you find... You find um, some interesting bullets. Um, what a sniper rifle. Yes. Oh, for a bird lady. Mm. Oh, yeah. You find some interesting oh. bullets. Um, Thank you, Ratato. Mm. You find some binoculars. Oh. oh. Ratato? Nice. Yeah. For that sharpie. <laughs> and you find some money that you can't use. Oh. oh. Shiny, though. Yeah, shiny. Ratato take. Yes. Ratato's like a seagull. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> And you also find a dog whistle. Oh! <gasps> oh. It's those doggos! Yeah, who have now effectively collapsed in front of the house. Oh. They're alive, they're just... Yeah, they need a rest. They need to heal. <laughs> Bloom the smithereens. <laughs> Alright. So now what do you guys choose to do? Are You're we still stuck maybe here in the exchange, hedge? exchange information about... Yeah, what each I've... team did on their little travel. Can we can we uh tie him up first though? I don't want him waking up midway. All That's right. a good idea. Mm -hmm. Sounds oh yeah, good. oh yeah. Is he not tied up yet? Okay, let's do it. All, All right. right. Still <laughs> so to tie an effective knot, somebody please roll uh crafts and dexterity. Uh, oh, I can do it. Okay. We have he rolls coming in. Yeah, you've got a couple turns before he comes to consciousness. Big rolls. Okay. Nice. Okay. Oh, big rolls. Nice. But a very nice looking knot. <laughs> <laughs> Looks good. Pretty knot. All right, sounds good. So you tie, you tie up this uh, this strange new character to a chair, um, this strange hooded figure, um, very very well. It's a very good knot. Um, you don't think that he'll be escaping, at least not easily, unless he's got some kind of special magic that you don't know about. But what are the chances of that? You're not sure. So. It seems that you've tied a very good and effective knot here. And now, um, he's still knocked out, so all you kind of have to do is wait, or you could wake him up yourself. What a oh. slap. <laughs> all right. What well, until you slap? <laughs> what a slap. Oh. Maybe we can interrogate him. Mm. Yeah. Mm. All right. But before we do that, let's take a small break, everyone. Okay. Okay. Go get some snacks. Go get a drink. Go <gasps> okay. to the washroom. Whatever you have to do. When we return, we will kind of go to the latter part of this session and see okay. how it all unfolds. See ya. Okay. Snack time. Snack time. Be right back, guys. Okay. Yeah. Be back, <laughs> me.
Huh? Hello? Hi, we're back. We've returned. We've returned. Wakey, oh. wakey. Wakey, wakey, everyone. Oh, it's time to continue uh, wow. the latter end of the story. <laughs> Last we left off, you guys were planning to interrogate this hooded sniper. Mm. And also ex exchange information uh, on what happened. Yes. Mm -hmm. A hooded sniper? Can we pull a Scooby-Doo and reveal who he is? Or they? Sure. Oh. Reveal their identity? Okay. Reveal their face. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> you pull off the hood of this hooded being, and below the hood is... Well, a humanoid creature that you've never seen before. In fact, uh -huh. someone very intriguing looking, actually. With a bit of a a dark gray complexion. Oh. An elf. Yes, in fact, in fact, well, you would think that. A dark uh, elf? A you high would think elf? that with um with the uh the pointy ears for sure. They're Very. the first thing that you notice. Mm. Yes. Yes, indeed. But there is something a little unsettling about this this being. Rather tall, rather thin. And something very shadowy about their face. Like they're yes. gaunt? Like they need to eat more? Or Yes, exactly. I see. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. I um <clears throat> I will just in case, um, stand behind him and hold my dagger to his neck. Mm. Clever. <laughs> All right. What what like when does I like do not trust him, Ada. When does encyclopedic knowledge come in handy? Let's see. Would I um, be able to mm -hmm. think of something in this situation? Uh, let's see. Encyclopedic knowledge. I would say not only because this is a creature that you kind of haven't dealt with before. Yeah. Okay. I would say in in this in this situation, but could be very useful in the future. Yeah. Especially um, in regards to like your research and whatnot that that you've done in the past and like your specific field, uh, you oh. you can pretty much recall um, all kinds of useful information related to that uh, on the spot by rolling oh. intelligence and wits. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, but just for the time Tiger. being, this is an entirely mysterious person. Read him some Wikipedia pages. <laughs> he won't like that. <laughs> Read him the Wikipedia about mite cheese. It's not cool. What? Mm. What? Mite cheese. M I T E cheese. It's disgusting. Anyway, continue. That sounds horrifying. <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> wow. Oh my goodness. All right. So, um, our hooded friend here begins to kind of <laughs> rustle a bit, comes to his senses. Ugh. Oh my god. Uh, Good partner. morning, Ada. Partner. Ara. Hello. Oh, what has happened to me? Huh. Oh. I hit you with my who shovel. Who you, Ada? Oh, my <laughs> head. Oh, I'm in so much pain. Oh, it hurts. I can't see straight. I think, I think you blinded me. You've blinded me. Who are you? Tell us, Ada. Who? Stop mumbling. Tell us who the hell you are, Ada. I tell you nothing. You have intruded upon my house. Then I'll we'll leave you here, and you're gonna starve to death. No, oh, please no, don't Ada. do that. Jimmy, out of this rope. No, uh, I still have things Listen, to do. Listen, buddy, we got a we have a party we're supposed to be getting to, and uh, if you can't give us any useful information, then I guess we will just leave you behind. Ah, uh, wait, so, wait, no, I'll don't leave I'll answer me here. the bird lady. Oh, please. The dogs, they get hungry. Please, don't leave me here. I, tic I tickle him with the dagger on his ah! neck. You no! feel that? Uh, no! Oh, it tickles so soft. To talk to us, oh, please. Ah! Oh, please stop that. I, I beg of you. I don't like that. Huh? Yeah, I'm sure you don't uh, like uh, it. I can slit your throat right now, Ara, if you don't I... tell us who you are and why you were trying to d d d kill us. Hey, hey, maybe maybe we should, we should give them... Give him a little bit of room to breathe a little, and then we can talk. Can't just be I will forceful, not give no. him room to breathe. He has been trying to kill both me and Vatoto. Mm. Maybe, maybe he yeah, has his reasons. Let's just let's just hear him out. Let's hear him out. 
why you shoot the Watoto. Mm. I'm listening. We were just we were just passing by when we when we stopped stumbled upon this uh hedge. And we were wondering if you could tell us how to get out of here. Mm. And what why you were shooting at us in the first place. Sir. Well you came to my junkyard. Everyone knows that if they come to my junkyard, they're going to get hunted. That's just how it goes. And then, of course, I brought you, or at least led you, to the hedge where things become more fun. A little closer to my home. I we like to live here. We didn't try to get into the junkyard in the first place. But you went to your crazy playground. Then. You mm, brought your big metal machine that. here, didn't you? Because you stole it! I stole nothing. I don't even know what that thing is. Well, so we still want to know who you are. Uh, okay, well, you've got me in a bit of a pickle here, so I suppose that I should give up a little bit about myself. My name is Bowlin. Bowlin Sniff. Most people just call me <laughs> Sniff. <laughs> yes, what's so funny? Sniff. Nothing, it's just, just Bowl. reminds me of a... Another friend we used <laughs> to know. <laughs> ah. Okay. Uh, maybe he's not so bad, guys. Maybe we can untie him, huh? No. No. no not so far. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I just have I mean... some interesting hobbies. I know that you may not understand them, you humans, but you came into my territory. I was only doing what I normally do. Came into oh. your territory and look who's tied up. Yes, I'm thinking it's very, not very rude. good at this. Well, no, I'm just trying to say that you're not very good at what you're doing here. So, why Toto has an idea. Oh, maybe we can okay. trade his freedom for for a vehicle. Mm. That's oh, a good idea. Yeah. Mm. Wait, mm -hmm. so do you know the way out of here? I know a way out of here. Yes, I can lead you. Can we trade his freedom for a way out? And a, and a truck. A truck? Mm. A what? What is oh. that? A junkyard. Big, big vehicle. Mm. Room, room. Ah, oh, the big monsters. Mm. Um, well, I suppose I could, I could try to help, but I don't really know a lot about that stuff. I really oh. only deal with the dead ones. It, it had been a long time since a live one came in. The dead. Mm. Well, you will have to give us back our car and then lead us out of here otherwise we're not going to let you stay alive ada watoto will feed you to the dogs no please i don't want to be no please they get so hungry <laughs> ah! yes, sir. do you know a way out of here yes or no yes i know where i know where a gateway is but they don't stay open long all right do you have directions to this gateway let's see Hold on a second. I think I do know of a permanent one. There, There is a permanent one, actually. I remember it clearly. Um, we must hurry, though. I don't... Uh, I don't have... Oh, we? I don't have much glamour left. What? We? Well, I'm supposed to guide you, am I not? Okay, <laughs> yeah, go find it by high. yourselves. And just oh. untie his feet. And then we'll, we'll... Keep his arms behind his back. He can lead us the way. I thought I was watching you. Mm. Seems like Mr. Sniper here needs some time in the chicken coop to calm down a bit. No, no chickens. Snappy Please. one. No chickens. All right Just, then, off we go to the gate. The I will show you the way. Who's lifting? Uh, Who's doing the fireman I, carry? I, I, I will do that. <laughs> Are they be strong? You have to roll something for that to carry him. <laughs> um, oh, let's I thought see. we were gonna let him walk. <laughs> I mean, no. I mean, he can walk, but. <laughs> All right. He's, he's sure. tied up, okay. and I'm not gonna untie him. All right, go ahead and roll your athletics and uh, strength. Mm, yum, 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 yum. Uh, three and. Nice. All right. Okay. Okay, uh, Tiara, you're able to carry him pretty easily, actually. I mean, dude's pretty thin. Um, hmm. 
and you're pretty strong. So that's nice. But mm. what's interesting is that he's really trying hard um, to, like, touch you in some sense. You are. Like, like, get, like, not in, like, a weird way or anything like that, but just, like, <laughs> make contact. Make, make skin contact. Stop mm. touching me or I will kill you, Ada. Why isn't it working? Mm. Mm. This isn't normally how this goes. Ah, uh, wait. Okay, so we walk. T tell us where we have to go, Ada. Fine. I'll direct you. Mm. Mm. Go straight forward. Mm. Okay. And We're keep going straight through. forward for a long time. Okay. We're doing that. <laughs> you guys walk. And you continue to walk through the maze. Uh, I don't know why I made myself disappear. Excuse me. You guys continue walking through the maze, but it seems as though, um, with the directions of this, uh, this new character that you're now holding, um, in your arms for some reason, um, it seems that, uh, he completely knows the area very well, even though it's constantly changing, which is very strange, um, he seems to have, like, an actually very clear and good idea of where you're going. Mm. And eventually you guys arrive to what looks to be some kind of garden. Of sorts. Oh! Mm. Pretty flower. Oh, cute! Looks like this. Yes. And there is what looks to be a pair of doors and many beautiful white flowers. And these ones are real, actually. Can I do a perception check if those are the real ones? Uh, the ones that I am... Um, uh, that I have all over my body? Sure. Mm. 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 Okay. Yes, they are the same ones. Mm -hmm. yes. Okay. Yes, and um... Bowlin kind of uh, wrinkles his nose. Doesn't like these flowers very much. Doesn't like you very much. You got hmm. these flowers on ya. Mm-hmm. He's not we a big know fan. That you don't like them. Hmm. That's why that why I have them on me in the first place, Anna. I mean I can well, deal he's trying with them. To pull some funny business, maybe it'd be better if you like threw him on the ground and stepped on him while we took a break. If he's trying to <laughs> put the bad touch on you because we don't mm. know what he's planning. Yeah. His weird brain. Well well. My dear Balin, or whatever the hell your name is. The Where... Is what is this place, Adam? This is the hedge. Though I'm sure one of you figured it out already. Rustling oh, through God. my things. I mean the <laughs> house, Adam. Hmm? Oh, this. Uh, it's it's a gateway. Not, not, the, not the gate itself. Inside, there's a mirror. You can go this through it. This will lead us to the real world, Adam? Yes, especially, especially <laughs> Kiara and Ina, who just disappeared <laughs> and went to another world. Already gone. We're yes. almost there. We're almost in the real world again, Ada. All right. I throw oh, the guy to the world. ground and step on him, Ada. Ah! <laughs> All right. Roll, nice. roll your, roll your brawl and strength. Brawling? Brawling is what I need. Wait, do I have brawling? I do not have brawling. <laughs> right, well, you want to do that? You want to do that big step? I mean, you can if you want it to do damage. If you want it to do damage, no, no, no. Okay. I wasn't trying to do damage. <laughs> right, you're just trying to kind of assert just, your dominance. Dominance, yeah, yeah. I see. All right, oh, you throw him on the ground. Uh, and assert dominance. Right. Why can I not? What do you think, girls? Do we still need him, Ada? Um, it's hard let's to keep see. him around. I mean, you want to bring him outside in the real world, Otto? Uh, Maybe it'll kill him. <laughs> oh my god. Let's kill him. I mean, he seemed fine, though, <laughs> to be honest. Oh, when you guys first met, but who knows where that could have been, actually. Up to you guys. Why can't I make a new place? Mm, All right, I did I, it. I see it. Okay, guys, uh, it's a different one. Hold on. Oh. Okay. One sec. They can, I mean... We can leave him behind, I guess, as long as... But, I mean, if he was shooting at you, what's to say he's not gonna come back for more? Yeah, mm -hmm. exactly. Yeah, um, he can chase us. I think we should kill him, Ada. I mean, I'm serious, Ada. <laughs> what do you 
anything about that battle, then are you opposed to uh... being killed? We had a deal. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Did we not? Maybe if he promises not to chase us. <clears throat> okay, it seems that we had a misunderstanding in the first place. Mm. No? I'm happy to leave you alone. If you leave me alone and we pretend that this never happened, and, and I'll even sweeten the deal. I can give you access. Also. I can give you access also. to somewhere. Somewhere oh. special. Somewhere uh -huh, useful is... to you humans. Someplace I could get in big trouble for telling you about. Oh. Mm -hmm. It's a nice place. It's a place where you can get many things that might help you on your journey. Oh. It's a, a market of sorts. Only available Why? here in this area. Why would you tell us that? How do we because get I want out? to live! <laughs> <laughs> and you can't get there without me. What do you guys say? Oh, sounds oh. good to Atata. Oh. No, but I trust him. He was trying some funny business with Tiara, right? Yeah. I don't really trust him, but... I think it is worth checking that thing. I think it's worth out. checking out, definitely. Mm. Mm. Why do I need to go shopping? <laughs> we still gotta buy our... Uh, our outfits for the party. Maybe they have some. Oh, oh. oh good idea. That is also mm. true. Alright. Mm. Uh, well, I think... Wait, we can keep him tied up though, right? We don't want to make it too easy for him to get back to his house, Anna. Oh my god. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright. <sighs> Alright, show us to your... Magic... Magician's closet then. Bowel. Alright. <laughs> okay. Bowel sniff. Uh, uh, can you, my name is I, it's either Bowlin or Sniff. You Bowel, may choose sniff. one. Alright, Sniff. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, fine. Let's go. <laughs> oh. It's through here. And he takes you to some doors. Um and inside this place is very simply just, uh, it's a big bathroom. Oh. With a mirror. What? <gasps> to a hidden dimension. Behind the mirror, there's a big hole that leads to the outside world. Wow. <laughs> How did you know? Shut that up. Just really? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, this is where we part ways. Um... I will give you a token, as promised. Here. And he gives oh. you um, a whistle. Mm -hmm. Made of thorns. I already took a whistle from his pocket. <laughs> Dog whistle. <laughs> Doggy whistle. This is a different whistle, Otto? This is a different whistle. Uh -huh. Yeah, he summons it out of thin air. Oh. oh. What does, does it, it do, give it to? Open doors, maybe? If you want to go to the special place where you can buy many nice things, you use this. But it won't work if I am dead. Oh. I don't I don't even think that is true, but okay, we'll give you that, Anna. It won't work if I'm dead! You must trust me. <laughs> it is the truth. Let's give him the benefit right. of doubt. Just take it. <laughs> take it and use it sparingly, as it can only be used once. Oh, once? Hmm. All right. Now let's never talk about Can this you ever make the again. Second one? No. <laughs> There's only one. That's the deal. Okay, Ada. Okay. I thought the will hold on to it. Sorry, I thought the. <laughs> so we're making uh, a contract. Uh, now hold on there, Mister. I'm not sure I'm gonna be signing no contracts. It's very simple. My life for this thing. You want Watoto autograph? It, huh? What? Excuse okay. me. What Can I add some something? Um, you'll we'll give you your life as long as you don't try to take ours again, Ada. Okay, I am fine with okay. the terms of this contract. Okay. All right. Good, Ada. Okay. Mm. 
Sign here. Uh... And a golden piece of paper appears. It states the terms. They're very simple. There's no fine print. Is there anything on the back? No fine print on the back either. Okay. Now... Um, Thank you. Watoto sign. <laughs> All right, Watoto sign. I mean, Watoto did make a make a deal with the with the worm, so I mean, I can see <laughs> why he'd be kind of nice to hear as well. That's fine though. It's fine. My my contracts are solid. He says, "I'm I'm not one of those one of those other sneakier type of changelings. I just like to hunt for fun. That's all. You came to my property, and I'm willing to forget it. I won't forget it ever happened." Don't hurt me. Can I cut his ear off as a keepsake? <laughs> <laughs> That's not part of the deal. All right. Are we all signing? Are we all off to sign? Just one. Just one is fine. <laughs> oh, okay. You all get right. in big trouble if you break it, though. Okay. Rock, paper, yeah, scissors. Right. <laughs> yeah, well, what did the send? Oh, what did the sign already? Uh. Yeah. Okay, okay. Wow, Watato's got a couple contracts. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to be breaking those contracts. All right. Goodbye. Oh. Goodbye. Well, get I out of my sight. Watato what? wants to take some flowers for later research. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You may take them. I also They're not still mine. have a lot of them on me. We can but share. You said this was your property. Oh. Okay. It is my property, but these flowers aren't mine. I want nothing to do with them. The property of the hedges. I mean, technically, it's also not really my property. It is my property, but it's more the Hedge's property. The Hedge is allowing me to stay. Just for a little while. My true home is in Arcadia, of course. Anyway, uh, goodbye, <laughs> and I wish to never see you again. Wait, Except are we untying him? Whistle. Is he untied? I'm just gonna hop home, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're not untying him, Ada. No, no otherwise, otherwise we're we're asking. Asking. How about we might Isn't want that... the rope? Uh, that's what I was oh, getting yeah. I want my rope. I'm oh, going, I'm going. Anybody got a zip tie? No. I would da right. dagger. I'll take a. Sh Can we just untie him? I'm hopping away. Yeah, let's, just, <laughs> let's, just, let's just untie him. Yeah, untie I'm him. Untie him. Untie him. I want my rope back. <laughs> the way he's hopping he does, seems kind of. Uh... Well, we got the contract, so he can't harm us. Got, I think right, that's can. what I'm thinking. Okay. A deal is so, a deal. Yeah. Mm. yeah. Mm. All right. Get his rope. <laughs> Taking my rope back. Oh, I mean, Goodbye. his rope, that is now my rope. Mm. Oh, Our oh, rope. Up. Our rope. <laughs> All right. All right. See ya. All right. Goodbye, Scram. Oh, yeah, yeah. Hey. Whatever. You're not, Wait a minute. You're not that Wait a minute. scary without that big old gun. What? My gun? Yeah, you what don't gun? have it anymore. It's mine now. Thanks, Ada. Bye. That wasn't a part of the deal. Bye. Bye. We're leaving. We're leaving. We're leaving. Hey, wait a minute. <laughs> no, 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 no. He no, begins no, to storm whistle. closer to you. <laughs> hey. No, 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 no. no. Hey. No. That's my gun. I need that. I point my dagger in, in, so into his face so that the, the tip of the dagger is like almost pinching his eyeball. You sure that you need it, Anna? Yes. It is my special gun. What? That what was not part of the doing? deal. The whole time, and he didn't have any problem with it until now. He's already because, signed the deal. Because you him. said you don't look so you don't look so big without that big gun, and I realized. Oh, he's blind. Isn't he blind? <laughs> no, not quite. <laughs> but you did remember. remind him of the gun. Yeah, you said you said you blind blinded him okay. with the shovel. Only for a moment. Oh, for a moment. It's like when you get hit well, in the head with I, something and you get like I will uh, stab his vision. eye with my dagger now. Not hurt him. He signed the contract. Girl, Tiara. No, that can't not, hurt no, 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 no. us. It was about taking lives, not about doing damage. We can do some more damage if we wanna. <laughs> I'm taking his eye, not his life. What All right. You're that? taking his eye. I'm taking his ear. Do it. <laughs> let's do it. Wait, 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 wait. Let's 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 not jump to I'm any not leaving, action. I'm not leaving the rifle behind. What? Then we just part ways. The contract, so Watoto cannot harm. You can. Sure you can. It's about not not uh, taking someone's life. No, the contract was we shall not harm each other. 
So he can't harm mm. us yet. Yeah. Later. It's kind of a weird situation. Bye. <laughs> Bye. 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 Uh, can I use the whistle? To you. Can, how do we get into the market? Or we just go through the mirror or something? Oh, the mirror is uh, the gateway. Oh. Mm. I do it. Yeah, we're going for it. Go, 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 go. I go, won't go, forget go. this. Bye. I will Bye. not forget this. Take care of the dog. Bye. -bye. Sorry. <laughs> All right. We should have killed him. Yeah. Yeah, right. Thanks, Scout. I know. All right. I'm with you. Uh, with that being said, you guys enter the mirror as he's kind of standing there, realizing that he can't hurt you because he just made this contract with you, even though you can't hurt him as well. A very, uh, <laughs> a very slippery situation indeed. You guys enter the mirror. And you come out. Oh, on the other side. Oh my oh. god. Oh, it was Oh, wait a, a minute. <laughs> on the other no! side. Oh my god! Wait a I minute! Did it! Along what? with the cockroaches Please. that also spill out from the mirror. Yeah. <laughs> I knew it! Yes, I think we still have time for the tacos. What time is it? What? Oh, the tacos. <laughs> yeah, what time is it? <laughs> Party time! It's taco time! It's approximately 3 a.m. No time has passed. Oh. oh. Barely any time, at least. Well, at least we made it back. But the oh. they be. That well, was crazy, I know. I suppose we can rest up now and then hit the road early in the... Well, it's already early in the morning, though. We can get a nap in now and then hit the road bright and earlier again. And we can find our way to the party, get some some outfit wear, and then be on our way to complete our. Do we have mission? the car now, though? Where's the car? Yeah, perception. Sure. <laughs> look through the window, see if the car is there. Oh yeah. Who wants to look? I look. Yes. Was okay. it actually stolen or not? One it's success? Yeah. Oh, there is no van. <gasps> I think oh. we left the van. Yeah, I wanted Should... to bring it, but... <laughs> he didn't really seem to want to guide us to the car. Yeah, it didn't seem like it. Mm. <sighs> he didn't know much about it. Well, we might be able to take a taxi or something. <laughs> In the morning. I think that'd be smart. Well, maybe we can... Yeah. We can... Because the car... Repair people will be here anyways in... The morning, afternoon, right? Maybe we can hitch a ride with them... To town. Mm. Or wherever they're located. Mm. Mm. Well, look at him with some pretty the eyes, stop. Ada. Their bus stop. Mm. 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 Indeed. <laughs> but it's rather late, so what would you guys like to do? Do you want to sleep? Do you want to... You want to... Get drunk? What do you want to do? <gasps> I guess sleep. Yeah. I think or don't people have, people have some sleep. injuries, right? So maybe be smart to sleep. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. First aid, and then sleep. Yes. Mm -hmm. First aid. All right. Sounds mm -hmm. good. Let's see. Would you like to roll your first aid? Yes. All right. I have three in medicine. That's right. All right. Let's see. You have three in medicine? Alright, whoever wants to do medicine yeah. checks. Go I ahead. I have one. <laughs> cool. Alright, um, let's see. Who do you want to do them on is the question. Oh. Well, oh. didn't Tiara get hit? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, true fact. Tiara first. Maybe, maybe yeah, then... uh, Scout can do Tiara and I can see if I can put, like, bandages on myself. <laughs> okay, <laughs> sure. Okay. So let's start with um Yule doing your self bandages. All right, let's okay. see. Um, by the way, I'm I'm just assuming that my bird came with me. Or did he? Is he here now? Oh or yes, Uhu has been following you. Okay, good, 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 good. Yes. Ooh. Good bird. Good bird. No problem. No problem. All right, let's Ooh. see. Okay, now let's see. We're gonna have you oh. do um. Uh, let's do a dexterity medicine roll for you, Yule. Okay. What if there's a specialty in medicine? What's your specialty? That's first aid. 
<laughs> okay. Let's see. Um, yeah, that should be fine. Uh, add a plus one. Okay. Okay, roll out. Okay. Alright, let's see what we got here. Okay, two successes sounds good. Uh, with those two successes, uh, let's see. Yule, how many bashing damage do you have? Uh, <laughs> like, um, uh, like full. Oh, full? Okay. Go ahead and take two bashing damage away. <gasps> Yay. Yeah. Okay, next up, Scout, you are going to, uh, perform some medical check on Tiara. Yes. All right, same roll, please. Go ahead and do a dexterity plus medicine roll. Uh, Thanks, Adam. Okay. You got it. <laughs> well, don't thank me yet. <laughs> Just kidding, you can thank me now. <laughs> Thanks, nice. Adam. One more. Okay. Tiara heal two bashing damage. Okay. What oh. the feel good? Yeah. Watoto's what what chilling. <laughs> Watoto healthy. All right. So with that being healthy said, horse. do you guys horse. sleep or do you do you party? No party. I think we had enough party, Ada. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta give you guys the option, just in case you want to. Uh, Watoto right. party, yeah. And there they go. Away they go. It's I'll fine. play with the cockroaches. <laughs> <laughs> Play with the cockroaches. <laughs> I'll try to find a corner to kind of crouch and get some sleep. But the cockroaches. Right. Sounds good. Let me make this again. Make this again. Okay. Um. So you guys uh kind of settle down for the night, essentially. Hmm. All right. Um. Z z z z. Oh gosh. Why? Z z z z. Please. Well, while Kelly is busy, let me just say, uh, Saturday, if anyone is uh, in Germany and going to Dokomi, I'll be there too. So check out my concert and my podcast at Dokomi in Germany in Düsseldorf. Let's go! Yeah, Let's do go. it! Oh. Heck yeah. And the following week is uh, me and Ame at... Uh, oh, um, MegaCon Orlando. That's right. Oh, oh. yeah, oh. we can talk about a little bit like the how the panel will work. So, uh, you guys will be able to ask us questions there in person, and uh, yeah, uh, Kiara and I will be each be on separate days. So I'm on mm -hmm. the twelfth, I believe, and Kiara will be on the thirteenth. So you can come mm -hmm. talk to us. Will there also be like a you know an MC there talking to us too? And yeah, it's mm -hmm. uh, interaction and panel. Yeah. Yeah! Heck yeah! Looking forward Ooh. to that! Mm. Sounds Potential exciting! Fun. I'm gonna tune in. Very excited. Oh, yeah. I, I don't know if it'll be live stream, I hope so. Oh yeah, yeah if possible. If, if not though, then yeah. <laughs> it might not be. But I will be there in spirit, and I want to hear all about it afterward. Mm. Yes! Mm. Yeah. I want stories. Yes! <laughs> Heck yeah. people in the crowd. Thanks. Mm. <laughs> Nice. Yeah, I'm gonna get to do that a couple times as well. I'm going to a Calgary yeah. Expo and also Fan Expo with uh, Gura and Watson. Yeah. Um, for Fan Expo and then let's see a Watson and Kusatori for Calgary Expo. So mm -hmm. very exciting mm -hmm. stuff. If you guys mm -hmm. want more info on that, maybe check out the whole live English Twitter. I think just today or yesterday they posted a press release and stuff on it as mm -hmm. well. Mm -hmm. Or if you guys want to see the dates, yes, yes, please mm -mm. check it out. Yeah. Uh, oh. Oh. Uh, oh oh dear. Good. Okay. Do you see it? Ah. Yay. Yes. Okay. Good. Yeah. I do not see you. Huh? The other side. The other. The other one. The other <laughs> side. Cursed all the way right up to the end. Right up until the <laughs> end, baby. Pull up English! Yeah, that's how we roll. That's how we roll. It's okay, yeah. we're at the end, I guess. So, it's all... It's all over. <laughs> Yay, there you are. Alright. Oh. I'm here. Yes. Okay, good. Let me grab you. By the ears. <laughs> grab you by the ears and drag you over here. 
Calliope is in control. Calliope is in control. <laughs> I'm in control. Mostly. Mostly. Hello, in control. I'm Ina. Ha Can we also give a shout out to Kelly's absolutely amazing new music video? Oh, yeah. 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 Thank you guys! Thank you! So cool! Thank you for enjoying it. I'm really happy you guys like it. I, I really... I'm That's very happy so with good. how it turned out. Thank you. Shout mm, 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 mm. out to Abby and Mama Mama Loney. Mm. Yeah, Mama Loney! Let's yeah. go, Mama Loney! So amazing. <laughs> Oh, hold on. There I am. There we are. There we are! Thank Back you guys together. so much. Back together so we can finish up this bad boy. Alright. Yeah. So. We sleep. You guys sleep. And morning comes, and before you know it, you hear... Uh, actually, outside... You hear a most intriguing sound. It's the sound of loud banjo music playing. <laughs> Come on! Oh. Woo! Ladies and gentlemen, somebody ordered a towel. We got tacos. Oh, they may us, sir, I should say. Breakfast! Oh, yeah. I know. Yeah. They're Bando two mama. rather friendly looking overall individuals um, in what seems to be a tow truck of some sorts, and they're wielding tacos in hand. Because, of oh. course, they are. Of course. <laughs> Howdy! Oh, I'm so hungry. Oh, howdy! You guys hungry? Yeah, we were at Taco Spring. What's that mean, howdy? That's oh. some fine banjo tickling I've been hearing, fellas. Yeah, you you like you like our you like this kind of music? Oh, we're gonna have good time. I sure do. We're I gonna sure have do. Time. We're gonna have good it's time. Pretty good, I know. I'll break out the spoons. Start up the washboard. Now we're talking. You got some good taste, little lady. Oh, banjery. <laughs> yeah. I think. Yeah. Jar? Yeah, you can blow. 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 I'll have some too. All right, all right. Here you go. And um, they <laughs> hand you off the tacos. <laughs> hand you off the tacos. And so and we're done. Uh, without us. Oh no, it's okay. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I made no, I made you guys go away. It's okay. We're fine. Oh, okay. um, ah. I had to make myself bigger. Um, they say, all righty. Okay. Uh, so where's the where's the truck we're towing? Uh, about that. Um. We were wondering if you could actually give us a lift to town, right? Oh, this town, right? Yeah, you Our you need a lift to town. Kind of, yeah, kind of broke down beyond repairs. Yeah. Mm. Someone stole so. a total van. Oh mm. man, you got some grand theft on your hands, man. Mm. Well, we'd love to help, um, but we're on a bit of a tight schedule. Oh man, there's got to be something we can do. Someone make. A persuasion roll or intimidation roll, however which way you want to approach this. Uh, persuasion. Persuasion. Of which I have none, so it shall not be me. I have, I have one persuasion. That's that's better than nothing. All right. Uh, Either manipulation or presence will work. Uh, okay. Ah. Well, Latoko has four manipulation. Ooh. Uh oh. <laughs> Oh no. I didn't, no. Oh man. Maybe Watoto? Watoto? Would you like to expend some willpower? Oh. Me? Yeah, we haven't been expending willpower recently. Uh, oh. You can if you want. Oh, sure. Wait, what? Do I have to? I can't roll again? Like, just. Hmm? I can't just roll again manipulation by itself? Or I have to because of. Oh, you can. Sure, oh, you okay. can if you want. Go for it. Okay. Yeah! All right, re-roll that 10. Mm. All right, now they're gonna roll to resist. <laughs> Uh-oh. What do you say, Watoto, up. by the way? What do you say to them? Uh, Watoto is very thankful for the Watataco, but uh, we have uh, somewhere we need to be, and uh, Watoto will have some coin if you need it, and uh, maybe we make a trade of service in coin. Mm. All right. Oh my. <laughs> all right. Well, basically cancels cancels itself out. They say, well, you got coin, all right. If you got money, I guess that changes things, but... Oh, man. All right. Go ahead and hop in. We'll give you a ride. Thanks. 
Thank you oh. so much, Ada. We appreciate it. No problem. It. Thank of course. You. Take you to the next town. They should have everything you need. Very convenient place. They got a whole McDonald's there, actually. Whole McDonald's. <gasps> Mac McDonald's? Yup. Couple other shops. Nice clothes shops, I've too. I've never even heard of them before. Sounds Do like they have uh, KFP? Okay, KF... KF what? KFP. KFP. Do they don't... KFT? Do, they, do you guys don't have it in your country? Kentucky Fried Turkey? Do they have KFP. KFP. Kiana Fried Phoenix. I've never heard of that before. Is it <gasps> good? Oh, it's pretty good. Never had a fried Sounds Phoenix delicious. before. Oh, man. It should be worldwide by now, but I'll... I'll I guess I'll... I'll go for some KFC instead. K K KFT? KFC. What's that? You got no KFC, but you got KFT? What is KFT then? Took fried turkey. All right, I'll go for that. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Sounds good. Maybe we can pick up some on the way. Let's go. These tacos ain't gonna <laughs> hold us forever. Tacos. Yay. Yeah, did let's go. Pay, uh, did we even pay the motel? <laughs> oh yeah, uh, I assumed you guys paid I... when you got the keys. Yeah, in the beginning. <laughs> okay, yeah, I also okay, paid okay. heavy coin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. So with that being said, loaded up into the truck, wielding tacos in hand, you guys drive into the sunrise, uh, off to the next town where you'll be able to grab some formal wear, and thankfully, it's very close to your next target. Oh. So you can finally begin your big mission. Lucky. Yeah. yeah. Congratulations on your first time escaping from the hedge. Mm. The first time. Yeah. As in, uh -oh. we'll be back? I mean, if I mean, who knows uh. what could happen, lads? Who knows? We should have killed that guy. <laughs> Got a neat whistle, though. True. Mm. Nice side quest oh, open. Yeah, two whistles now. If we yeah, can use that as like an escape, if like something real bad happens. Ooh, we there's some good in. thing. Yeah. Good thing. Mm. You did get a neat mm. item out of it, I will say. Not quite a bit of items now. Yeah, you guys Trouble got some good stuff. Lanterns. Yep. Mm -hmm. By True. the way, you guys get a letter pack sent to you. It arrives at the motel before you guys leave. It's full of your cell phones. Oh, <laughs> yeah, thank you. Uh, <laughs> lucky. Oh, okay. How nice. uh, yeah. The, the madam says, <laughs> forgot these and sent you your cell phones. Oh, Don't I forget them anymore. Nice, Sarah. Nokia. Very relaxed. <laughs> Oh, I can't trace this. No screen. Mm. That's right. Huh? That's right. All right. So with that being said, we have finished the second session. Yay! 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 Oh, you guys did it. You did it. And we will be awarding EXP on our own time as well. And we will tell you guys all about the brand new stats before the next mission. Cool. So, yeah. yeah. So look forward to that. Please anticipate. Anticipating. Anticipating. Yeah. I think the next one, it'll be on someone else's channel that isn't me or Kusatori. So, mm -hmm. yeah, please okay. anticipate. And uh, we'll have ourselves a fun time in the next session when you guys are going to tackle your your first big mark. Oh. Ooh. Oh. Scary. Scary. Yay! You guys will be fine. Maybe. Make some good choices, you'll but, uh, be fine. Thank you, what? Kelly, for Thank your you. hard work. Thank you. No problem, guys. I was really worried about this one because I literally, I just got off a plane. <laughs> I just yeah, got off a plane. Worried. I was worried I was not yeah. going to be high energy, so I tried my best. Oh, yeah, it was well. totally Thank fine. Yeah. I didn't notice a difference at all. Yay! Mm -hmm. Well, you guys were also really fantastic players as well and uh, very much making decisions on your own and leading uh, the story, so that was really great. Yeah. You guys are naturals. <laughs> naturals, I tell you. Uh, yeah. Only because we have you here to guide us. Oh man. Yeah. Exactly. You guys are making me blush. Oh jeez. Thank you. <laughs> I can't wait to keep playing. We have so much more fun <laughs> stuff. <laughs> Plan to the future. It's gonna be great. Looking yeah. forward yeah. to it. Yeah. I'm looking forward to it. Heck yeah. Thanks everyone for watching. Thank you so much, Thank guys. You. What should we sign Thank off you. on? I wonder. Mm. Well, Breakers. Well, last time we said Ultimate, right? Yeah, Otsumith. Oh. Otsumith. Otsumith. Mm -hmm. Otsumith Breakers. Otsumith. Okay. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, okay. ready? Three, mm. two, one. Otsumith, Otsumith Breakers! Breakers! Woo! Goodbye, everyone. See ya Bye. next time. Bye.
Peace. Thank you for watching. Auf Wiedersehen.